Okay, looks like it's all good. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. We are going to get settled, and we are going to be playing some more Zelda Spirit Tracks. And like I put on the top screen at the end of last episode, we have a little reminder as to what I'm supposed to do right now. Let's do this. We got a letter from Carbon about how to get to the Ocean Temple. Dear self, I know you'll forget, so I'm leaving you instructions to get to the ocean floor, Carbon. Um, wait, what? Oh, there's a picture on the other screen. I almost didn't see that. Hang on a second. Let's go here. Uh, one, two, three. All right, then. Wait, did I, did I do that right? Oh, no, I did not. I'm, I'm, hang on. That's not an island for three. Silly me. I think I noticed that. <laughs> I would have been running around being like, what did I do? Three is just like, looks like the entrance or something right there, because it just goes to a dead end. All right, that looks good. We'll put this away and we'll get to it. This has been a very fun playthrough so far. A very fun and cozy playthrough. People, a lot of people have been telling me they, they're enjoying it. A lot of people also tell me they, they think the PNG tuber is very cute. So I want to use it again today. Because why the heck not? You can't stop me. We've restored the tracks. Why don't we head out to the Ocean Temple? Heck yeah. Okay then, let's go. The last thing we did was we finished the, the, the latest flute section. Somehow I got through it relatively easily. Okay, go through here. Anyways, hope everyone is extra cozy today. Let's do this. That'll do. Perfect. You guys let me know how the audio sounds and we'll get nice and cozy. I felt a little bit sick again last night and I did not fall asleep until super late. And that what made that worse was that the, um, the clocks actually sprang forward. So... I feel really weird right now. I was tempted to just do a long stream so I have more stuff ready to upload. Oh, bunny. But I'm like, no, no, let's just do a short stream and I'm gonna make sure I rest after we finish today. Thank you, Tack Universe, for the sub. We got an ocean rabbit that can walk on water, apparently. I see dolphins. I don't see a crystal on that. I swear I'm checking, but I just don't see them. No problem. You've enjoyed the playthrough too? That's good. Yeah, don't worry, I checked the map. Oh, hey, buddy's over here. I just realized I wasn't going in, um... I wasn't going in double speed again. Oops, I was focused on the map there. So, we meet again! I heard the ocean spirit tracks had returned, so I came to see myself. It's just a rumor, but I hear there are even tracks that run underwater. Oh, and guess what else? Just guess. They say there's sculptures that react to big noises out there, too. Okay, so I got a whistle at the statues or something. I'm sure I'm glad I interrupted my route for that. All right, chat, let's go again. Like the Avatar? I thank you. I appreciate that. Pictures taken instantaneously. Everyone say Fuzzy Pickles. Hang on, I gotta lower my own headphone volume. It's a little bit loud. I think the game's decently loud. The overworld's a little bit louder than normal. Or the rest of the game, I should say. Dungeon and overworld themes are generally pretty quiet. Oh. Hang on, I'm gonna catch the bunnies. Oh, come on. Got one. You got an ocean rabbit. Even that track felt quieter compared to that, didn't it? Oh, I actually did the, um... I actually protected the locomo on the train first try. That wasn't too bad. If he gets hit once, do you have to start the whole thing over? That looks like it'd be a pain in the ass. Apparently I've been... According to some people, I've been solving some of the problem parts very quickly, surprisingly. I feel like I just get lucky when the flute works, though, to be honest. Now, what do we have over here? All 
All right, I figured it out. I just gotta toot my horn. And next, we go over to that way. That. You get a game over if it happens. Oh yeah, I'd imagine. So you basically do gotta start over. Ugh. Well, I hope I'm not gonna do that again. I was pretty fast with it, I guess. I find that sometimes the combat, when it's when it requires you to be very fast and hectic, it can be kind of awkward to do. Because remember, you gotta use the oh, there's the temple part. You gotta hold down L and R button to use your 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 Zelda item, and then you gotta draw the path of the boomerang, and you also need to use the touch screen to move. It, it feels a bit awkward, and I feel like I the one um, advantage I have by playing the game on my Wii U is that the screen, even on the gamepad, is much, I have a much more wider room to use my stylus compared to an actual DS. Okay, we're not there yet. And that's the only time? Okay, good. I feel like of all the Zelda games that have like a bunch of frustrating parts, this one seems to be one of the biggest for that. Okay, let's do it. Bunny acquired. I'm gonna catch the bunnies. I don't know if it's gonna do anything. Okay, I see the next one. Bear Streamer toots as he wishes. Feels better on actual DS, does it? I mean, people have said back and forth that uh, the DS mic can be pretty crusty. Hang on. Either it works or it doesn't, or it's broken half the time. Thank you, Waffle, for the sub there. What is that noise? Ah, pirates! There was no crystal in that ring. So I can't use it. I feel like I just don't have access to a lot of these shortcuts, which is weird. Shoot the horn. Aha! There we go! <clears throat> okay. Ouch. Pardon me. Oh. I'm, I mean, there is a microphone hotkey you can use for emulators that, like, trivializes microphone stuff. I find it's more the touchscreen stuff that's more annoying to do for emulators. Alright, we're underwater. It's breathtaking down here, isn't it? Um... Hold up. Yeah, let's go to the Ocean Temple. Um, Link is in a magic bubble. Oh, the cannons become torpedoes. That's a neat little detail. That's cool. Okay. All right, let's get cozy for a second. Let me let me hydrate while we have a moment to ourselves. Oh wait, hang on, hang on. I gotta put it down. There's a squid still coming at me. Nice. Oh, boy. Oh, there we go. I wonder if there's bunnies underwater as well. That would make about as much sense as everything else. You have to admit, these the two Zelda DS games were very ambitious for what they were. They really did want to take full advantage of, like, the platform they were on, though. And, and, and everything still works enough on Wii U, but... In the future, there's not really going to be a way to play these anymore. Especially since the eShop is down. Thank you, you like my model? Thank you. Everybody's been so nice about the model. Been, like, 99% very positive comments all the way through. I've still been getting fan art, too, which is so nice. I'm gonna hit those fish. I've been talking about starting a few games once the, um, the finished commission one is ready with all the different states. Because I wanted to have some games specifically just for using this. Hang on. Come on, hit it. I've been saying before that playing DS games is perfect for it because we have the extra space. Okay, got him. But I mentioned it during last stream, there was like a couple uh, ROM hacks I was looking at. There was one called like Recharged Yellow, which looked cool. That seemed pretty neat. Uh, pretty neat. Blah, can't talk. It's like Pokemon Yellow completely re 
created on Pokemon Emerald's engine. Oh boy, <clears throat> pardon me. Dylan got Pokemon Ranger working with his drawing tablet. Yeah, you can get drawing tablets working with um, DS games. It's a little bit weird. Not the most accessible thing to do though, because no one, no one's gonna buy a drawing tablet to emulate DS games. Let's move this here. Oh, good. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Looks like we have no choice but to go the long way around because he's doing this. Did I? Did it set the train to normal speed and I didn't notice this whole time since I was underwater? Of course it did. Of course it did. Hmm. Let's go this way. Let's just go this way and everything will be okay. Oh, oh, boy. Pardon me, home that cough. I'm still a little under the weather. I want to make sure I get to get some early sleep today. Again, I was super tempted to just say screw it and do a long stream, so I have more to upload to make up for lost time, but, like, that that's not going to work. I'm just going to feel like crap if I do that. Oh, come on, man. What's the difference between these two? It looks like the iron one is, uh, faster. Okay, maybe we'll be fine if I go like this. Uh-oh. Resting is important, I know. But I never listen. I keep telling myself I can just get a little bit more done. No matter how many times I am proven wrong. This is not a good time. Why can't I hit the squid? I am literally tapping the squid right in front of me and it's shooting like the top of the screen. Oh, this is great. Hang on, I just barely avoided them through dumb luck anyway. I, put, I picked the right path. Okay. Yeah, hit the squid. Hit the squid. Hang on. Okay, there we go. We're just about done here. Oh, my. Oh, this is a pain in the butt. The amount of rubbing you gotta do on the screen right there. I feel like I'm gonna tear the thing apart. Okay, they're coming for me, don't worry. We're fine. I don't know what it is all of a sudden, but I can't seem to aim at the squids, even though I'm directly tapping them. The, the missile just goes where the hell it wants. Maybe it's just janky, because this is the only part of the game where you use missiles instead of bombs. Come on, let's get in there. We are going to temple number three, everybody. I feel like a lot of the overworld sections with the track, they're... They're kind of arbitrary with how they just want you to progress. You, you know what I mean? Like, it's not open. Obviously, it's on rails. Ha ha ha. But it's just kind of like, go here. Also, you have to go around this specific way because we put a thing on the tracks. Like, yeah, nothing you can do about it. Here we are at the Ocean Temple. You're ready to go in, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, then. Onward. How bad could the Ocean Temple be, chat? No way it's bad. It's gonna be awesome. Okay, same dungeon theme, but at least it's catchier than Phantom Hourglasses. I still gotta give it give it that. Phantom Hourglasses, the dungeon theme was literally just one note. Oh! Okay, grappling hook. Grappling hook is the item here. Or maybe it's the whip, actually. Hang on. Because the grappling hook thing was different in Phantom Hourglass. Second is above here. Hang on. Let's get warmed up with my combat, everybody. And what do these say? The third is above here. Oh, I see. There's gonna be a floor above with switches, and I need to mark these here, don't I? I see, I see. The 
fourth one is above here. The first is above here. Easy. Can't get me. Too stealth. Too stealth for ya. Oh no, it's just that thing. No one needs to wake those guys up. Chat, I feel like you've been good, so you deserve you deserve a bear. Let me go ahead and give you that. Boop. Now there's a teddy present on the stream. Isn't that nice? Isn't that wholesome? Bears make every stream a little bit more wholesome, don't they? I don't have a shield. Right, I lost my shield. So can I just, like, not do anything about this now? Can I hit them with my sword, maybe? Okay, hang on. One, two, three, four. Left, right, up, down. Left, right, up, down. Thought they were gonna shoot at me while I did that. That was gonna be annoying. Okay, that was easy. Okay. How the heck do I... It doesn't seem like there's enough time for that. That goes like that. Okay. Yeah, they're making damn sure I can't just cheese that. No, there's nothing up there. What? What's the point of this? Hang on. I think I know what I gotta do. I'm overcomplicating it. I gotta do this for some reason, right? Well, what does that do? Does it mean boulders are gonna fall down on the previous floor? That's all I can think of. Let's try that. Let's see. Your GF says the Teddy model is very cute. That's awesome. Everybody should like the Teddy model. It's annoying. No shield, because I didn't go get another one. There's no pots here, either. So I activated that switch upstairs, and I have no idea why. Okay. Now there's boulders falling there instead of here. Yeah, that's what I did. Okay, that's on... That needs to be set on fire or something. Come on, give me stuff. I don't want to use my freaking potions on that yet. White hair suits me well. Thank you, I like it. I like the monochrome look with the yellow and blue, because that's what I do with my logos. Okay. I redecorated a little bit. No big deal. Get that jelly. It stops being electric, uh, electric after you hit it with a boomerang. Small piece of wood, that's the rule. The dungeons in this game do not feel long at all. I mean, Zelda games do have short dungeons, depending on which one you're playing, of course. But, like, this game is, like, has major dungeons only, and the major dungeons feel like, basically like Light World dungeons in, um... Oh, there's the whip, okay. In Link to the Past, you know what I mean? Okay, can't use items. Can't use that either. Can't run from him. Okay. Can't hit him. Can't run away. What on earth do I do here? Do I cut it? Maybe I gotta, like, roll. Nope. No, I can't seem to roll either. I'm, 
gonna die trying to figure out what it is I'm supposed to do here. Because he will not get hurt by the sword. Nope, can't bait that. It's gonna be so obvious when I figure out whatever the hell it is. Run around him? Didn't I try that? That was like one of the first things I tried and it didn't seem it had an effect on him. Maybe I didn't do it enough. All right, let me try again. Hang on. I already opened up the shortcut, so let's just go right to it. That's why I didn't want to waste my potion there. Don't need those pots. Don't need to waste time on that either. Jump slash? I was trying to do that. It doesn't work, friend. That's the issue. A lot of what Chad is suggesting literally just does not work. That's why I was just ru standing there. He doesn't let you. Okay, I can't run around him. Don't tell me. I want to figure it out and then rage at how stupid it is. If I stand here... That does nothing. If I try to attempt to hit him with my sword in any way... Wait, what? Oh, now it works? What? Oh, give me a break. Can't just change the rules like that. Whenever you try to use the sword, he just, he just whips you around. So I'm just supposed to, like... Do it when he pulls me? That feels so janky. I don't like that. <sighs> Come on. See, that's what I was trying before, and... <sighs> sometimes I hit him, sometimes I don't. Whatever, that's stupid. I'll call it stupid. Like I parry his fist or something. Whatever. Do you see this crap, Teddy? Teddy sees it. It looked weird? Yeah, it felt weird. Four doors are opening. Anyways, let's just get the whip. He's dead. You got the whip. Tap the screen to give it a crack. It's a snake whip. Tap and hold objects to latch onto them. Tap and hold for a certain flying object to hitch a ride. Well, at least I don't have to use the microphone for it. Okay, so I just tap and it goes that way. Nice. This one feels very responsive and weird. Or just fine. Okay, let's go up here. seems to go on its own. I don't need to, like, stop. Alright, they don't seem to care about that. Locked door over here. Oops. Darn it. Is there a quick button for swapping? No, it's only... It only brings up the menus, and I have to tap to switch. Kind of wish there was a button to quick swap items now that I have a few. All right. Let's go over here. No, the whip guy was weird. You have to, like, use your sword at, like, a very specific moment when he pulls you forward. And if you try it at any other point, he just kind of, like, hits you anyway or whaps you away. So I thought the sword wasn't working, so I was trying to figure something else out. That's why I was confused as hell. Yeah, let's try going up this way. Three handles sit before you. Pull only the one furthest from your grasp. Furthest from your grasp? Okay. Funny puzzle. Okay, they do- they're stunned for a split second when I do the whip. That one was clearly electrified anyway, but it worked. Oh, hey! Is this what those statues in Link to the Past are supposed to look like? 
think so. Okay, furthest from my grasp, so the one with the shortest path. What a puzzle, Mark. D-pad just pulls up, uh, hang on. If you press left or right on the D-pad, it brings up the menu. If you press up or down on the D-pad, it does this. Or if you're left-handed and using the left hand for your stylus, the, 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 the face buttons work as the D-pad, essentially. So those arrows will just get me if I do that. Easy puzzle. Okay, that's a door. Why is that one looking at me like that? Got him. Oh. Cool. The rise from nothing. Small key. Look at the way his mouth is moving. Look at him, chat. He's more animated than me. Throw that there. There we go. I don't know if there's anything left in the previous floors. Extra dungeon chests are kind of useless. It just seems like they give you treasures. I don't feel like going out of my way for those. What does this do? Yay! Over the door. This goes all the way over there, but it looks like the door is closed anyway, so let's go this way first. Oh, wait, this is a shortcut. Never mind. What's even the point of going back that way? I don't know why they do that. Excellent. Don't need those. Save the hearts in case something silly gets me. Better than me versus stamps. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. One of the absolute worst things of Twilight Princess HD was the fact that several chests... Instead of having rupees, they had Miiverse stamps, a service that shut down literally a couple months after Twilight Princess HD came out. I can't even... God, that is that is so miserable when you just open those and you find a Miiverse stamp. Man. I, the, I want a Switch version of Twilight Princess HD just so they can get rid of that. I don't even care if I never play it. I just, like, want the Miiverse, like, scrub from that game's existence. It's not fair to Twilight Princess, I'm telling you. Okay, there's a bunch of ones right here. What's the solution, though? Let's go over this way. Oh. Gotcha, boy. Why is he dressed like a high school janitor? With a masquerade mask. Or a ballroom mask, I should say. Okay, they're kind of in the way. That's annoying. Clearly, I need to outwhip them. Where'd the other one go? He's stuck in the corner. Get him. Easy. Wonder if the devs knew the service would shut down. Mini-boss becomes normal enemy. So these ones have three inside them. Uh, okay. I gotta hold the stylus down to stay attached to this thing. That's weird. Let's find out where this takes me. Welcome everybody, welcome. I hope you're all doing good. This is the third dungeon. Ocean Temple. This is a very slow way to transport ourselves over here, I have to say. Okay, that's how I get back, clearly. But what's this do? Oh, I, I know what I need to do. Oh. No, hit them. 
No, hit them. Ah! Oh. This doesn't seem to be it. Can I spin it around? Oh, now it hits them. Seems like it's really finicky. Because I'm definitely trying to, to tap it for a direct hit. But it keeps just, like, going around them. Probably because of the way they're shuffling, that's all. Okay, I made a grapple hook thing appear, so now we need to go down. Or was it, like, being thrown over them? Is that what it looked like? I don't know. This is the slowest thing I have ever seen in my life. Come on, take me over here. Take me over here. Clearly, I need these to fit something. They all need to go over in that one, or what about over here? Hang on. Yeah, give me some hearts, please. One, two, three are missing. One, two, three. They're in a different pattern, though. Is there significance to that? third one missing from you. Small key door lock there. Yeah, that wouldn't do anything. the wall there. I guess I need to take these things. No, I can't move them, right? I can't drag them with me. Oh, I just pull them all out? That's weird. The fact that they were swords, though, was telling me I needed to throw them somewhere, but okay. Okay, that one didn't matter. Maybe the two of these sides need to match up. Well, I've already broken it anyway, it's fine. These ones respawn now. I am so confused what this room assumes I should do. Because those ones down there need to just be pulled out. These ones apparently need to be arranged a certain way. It's so weird. Anyways, I made stuff appear back there, but I can't go there yet. Let me just reset the- wait, wait a second, can I pull the thorns off? Hold up a second. Uh... Can't seem to throw it inside you. Oh, yeah, that's all I have to do to walk through it? Oh. I thought I had to, like, burn it down or something. Okay. What the hell is all these things for? Three blades sit in a row. Retrieve them all and the path may open. Oh, well, I already figured that one out. Seems like I figured something out. In Wind Waker, when you see the spiky thorns, things less spiky than this will just murder you. Well, I already got these set up, so let's do this way. I did it, everybody. I solved the puzzle first try. Do you see that, Teddy? Wait, Teddy? Teddy, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, Teddy ran away. Teddy fled. They have a real chance of doing that in Pokemon Crystal. We gotta wait for the bear to come back now. Excellent. Now I can get back. So now that I've got my whip, 
Can I do stuff over here? Wait. Oh, this is a different floor? Oh, I see what to do with those ones now. Remember the placement of the blades. That knowledge will be useful in another similar room. I love how they have to spell it out for me. Like, yeah, I could figure that part out now that I know there's a similar room. That wasn't the issue. Okay. That's the case. I'll do that. So much for that. Is this the same? It is actually. It's the same pattern as over there. Circle, circle, X, circle, X. He's down there. No blades there, but there's something... Why does this look like that? I can't believe that's all you have to do to get through the freaking thorns. I'm a little pissed about that. It's so simple. You just pull them off with the whip? I didn't even consider that something like that would be, like, would, it would work in a Zelda game. I just, just so happened to click it with my whip, and I was like, oh, it pulled the thorn off. Lucky me. Why are the fi uh, the fishes on the wall pogging? They're trying to have a good time. They're stuck there for their, in, all of eternity. Don't take this away from them. Let me see. Well, we got that. What's over here? How about this? Oh, there's the small key. Nice. Let me get a drink. Oh, I gotta tell you, that drink feels refreshing. Oh, let's go over here. Excellent. Oh, don't do that. This one has a thing right here. Is it saying that one needs to be empty, or what? Okay, so the very edges are the ones that need to have nothing or something. That's what it seems like. Okay, let's go back downstairs. I think I got the puzzle done. I think I do. How long have I been in here? Uh, yeah, this seems like the longest temple so far. Not surprising. I love how the temple theme in this game is just, like, sneaky music. Like... This music sounds like it would just be, like, the sneaky music that plays during the one stealth section in every RPG. Oh no, you got to get the thing from the library. Watch out for the castle guards. Okay. So we know what, the pl we know what to do here. That's that. Before that, though... Hmm. Why was that one like that, then? Not sure I get it. The one's down here, anyway. Nah, I don't think I care enough. Let's just do this. Oh, wait. Open wide. Oh! Okay, good thing that responds. I swear I tapped the fish directly. Wait. Is that not it? Um. That, that was it though, right? something I'm overlooking.
Let's see. Circle, circle. X, circle, X. Circle, circle, X, zero, X. I definitely wrote that down, didn't I? Yeah, that is, that is what I wrote down. So is there something else I missed down there I need to configure it? I think I need to use the small key first or something. Maybe there's something behind here I need to find. Oh. There's a thing in the way. I think that's supposed to unlock that. Hmm. Oh, boy. Did I miss something? I'm positive that was the thing when I wrote it down, right? I need to go back up and double check. That should have been what I needed to do. You know, I, or I organized them all. Maybe d maybe the ones down... Sorry, the, the two sections with only three of them also count towards it. I thought they wouldn't because that one section of three was its own puzzle. Alright, let's try again. Yep, that's the right pattern. Yeah, that's also right. So it's got to be the ones down here, then. This one has nothing, just like the one downstairs. So I'll write it down anyway. Okay, and this one is just XOX. I don't know if this one counts towards it, though, because I don't know. Whatever. I guess it must. I just assumed it didn't because that the, those ones were their own puzzle on the other floor, so... Whatever. That's all I gotta do, clearly. Let's do it. I was paying attention to the little blue things on the floor, wondering if there was, like, a separate puzzle related to that, but I think it might just be aesthetic. Okay, let's try this again. Grab that there. I said grab that there. XOX. Or, yeah, that's how it is. Okay. Grab you and... Uh-oh. My menu icon was blocking the way. Damn it. Okay, too close. The only issues I've had with the whip has just been, like, hitting people with it. So I think I gotta pull all these out again. They don't respawn. This was XOX. Means just do that. Just do that. Yeah, it was that. I just had to move one thing down there and I didn't realize it. Wasn't this section its own puzzle? Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what exactly what I'm talking about. I thought I didn't ha I thought it was only the northern parts because of that. Oh, I'm sure I'm not the first person to make that mistake. Yeah, we got that. Why is there a little thing here? I think it's just there because Okay, the boss door is over there. Oops. I I keep forgetting. You have to hold the stylus to the touch screen. Obviously, if you guys haven't figured it out, my, um... Oh, I have to land on the block, I see. My, the little sparkly you see is where I'm touching with the stylus. That should be pretty obvious by now if we're, like, eight hours in. Ooh. This dungeon was where you stopped playing the game? It doesn't seem that bad. I was just kind of confused. Gotta specify confusion. Me, me, myself. I've, I'm, I'm a streamer chat. If I if I show that I'm confused with something for even five seconds, someone assumes that I'm like blaming the game or something. There we go. Let's go, go, go. There it is. 
Oh, you're just procrastinating. You can see that, yeah. It's a snake whip. Yes, it is. You think it inflicts poison? That's would be a pretty hard design for a uh, poison whip. Not that bad, and I get attacked by Floor Master. Oh, that's grappling. How bad. Perfect. I could have been stuck on this for hours, and I just so happened to whip the thorns. Genuinely, if there is something that would get someone stuck on this place as a child, it's absolutely the thorns. I feel like that's just not something you'd, I mean, I'd immediately think, because of how the thorns work in Wind Waker. Step into the blue light. Now, the floor masters just take the uh, dungeon key out. Okay, let's see if I can do the boss. The bosses have a weird touchscreen angle, so I kind of have to adjust. Oh, what do we have here? Don't die. Chad, it's boss time. You know what that means? We need a Teddy. Teddy's here for moral support. He's going to help us beat the boss. Okay, this looks neat. Oh, the boss is the plant. That's neat. Oh! I'm dead, chat. I can't believe Link just freaking died. What we have here? Let's go fight it. Oh, right. Oh, come on. No way do I have to wait for the whole thing. Come, no, come on. <sighs> That's mean. Not only is it slow as hell, but if you miss it, you have to wait for it to manually disappear like that. Barbed Menace. It looks like it'd be a boss in Mario Luigi Partners in Time. Alright, chat, we're gonna whip it good. You see this crap, Teddy? It's go time. Oh, this is the part of the temple that's sticking out in the overworld. That's cool. Okay, we gotta take the thorns off. Oops, I let it go by mistake. can come out of the thorns, too. That's nice. Okay, I got it. Oh, it's all the way over there, damn it. Ah, oh, damn, I only got a few hits that time. Really regret not going to buy a shield before coming here. At least they're pretty generous with the hearts on this one. Oh, I hit the side again. No problem. Or phase two. Is this boss theme a remix of something? The, re uh, the boss theme in Phantom Hourglass was a remix of um, the Link to the Past dungeon theme, which was cool. Oh, damn it. Okay. Getting stronger here. They hit me out of that, and I can't use it no more. Oh, 
Oh, it was one slash away. I'll probably pick up extra heart containers, yeah. I know where one is. Wow, the Indigo Force Gem. That was a neat boss fight. That one functioned pretty just fine. It's a Z. I had to... Ooh, my hand feels a little cramped. Ooh. I'm good, though. We can do this, chat. Not even an hour. It's a wholesome day. This boss functioned. What praise. Yes. It was fine for what it is. They, it's a Zelda boss. They still die piss easy. You knock the thing down three times, you win. That's a, that's like almost every Zelda boss for like the for twenty years. Twilight Princess was the most infamous for that. Twilight Princess has like the most intimidating boss designs, and they're the all piss easy. <laughs> Yay! And then Skyward Sword wants you to perfect, like, sword parry. The final fight was kind of cool for that, though. Way to go! You did it, Link! Do you see that, Teddy? We did it! And now we can go to the Spirit Temple from here. Ocean rail map started glowing. The tracks the tower of spirits have been restored. Sometimes you just need a moral support bear. Come on, let's go back to the tower of spirits, Link. You got a heart container. Well, time to leave. Teddy is so happy to be here. Everybody wishes they could give this bear a hug. Yeah, let's get out. You want to ride the train? Heck yeah, I do. Minish Cap turns 20 years old this year. Oh, I'm old. Never too old to hold a bear, though. Okay. There's no way a train could get in the way here, right? Toot the horn. Heck yeah. All right, that went pretty well. That one was a little bit longer than the other dungeons for sure, so they're starting to step up. Teddy is so happy to be here. Yes, it is. Hmm. Oh, pardon me. It's holding back a, a hiccup there. It felt weird. I wonder when I should go stop by the rabbit guy. I feel no need to, though. Come on. Zelda collectibles are so weird. Go out of your way and you just get 20 rupees. I remember the crank at the double speed this time, so don't worry, we're good. Ah, crap. Pirates. Hang in there. People, like, um, putting cannons on a train was never a real thing, right? That fe I feel like back in the day, that would be, like, way too difficult to aim other than just blind fire. Would it have even been, like, worth it? No, it would be on rails. You wouldn't be able to get the damn thing near, near a target unless it was extremely specific. Oh, it was- it was a thing? Damn. Well, guess I don't know nothing. Hang on, let's catch the bunny. Cause like, the tracks would already have to be there, right? What are you gonna do, lay down some, lay down a railroad next to the enemy? It would have to be like a place you could already just kinda get into. I don't know. I'm not an expert in such things. Cannons were not accurate, no. They were just for, like, blindly hitting people. 
No, bull I'm not bullying the bunnies. I'm, I'm taking them to a home. The safest place to be when a cannon is firing is right where they're aiming. <laughs> Shoot that horn. All right. We're almost there now. Let's keep going. Any more bunnies? I can't adjust the camera here. Now I can. I was stuck on something there. Okay, no problem. <clears throat> no problem. Goodness, the bear is so happy. Yes, he is. He's happy because he's watching a video game stream with me. Like all of you. You should all get some cocoa. I can't- I don't have a button to give the bear cocoa, unfortunately. Anjin, the spirit tracks between the ocean temple and here have reappeared. Yes, nicely done. Now there's but one temple left until all the tracks are restored. Once they are, we'll be able to enter the altar of the Demon King. Just one more step. To get to the next temple, do we have to go to a new realm? Yes, the next temple is hidden in a mountain of fire. But first, go reclaim the rail map that will restore the way to the next realm. Let's go, Link. I mean, you know, we could also just walk there. Like, uh, we don't need the train tracks to do it. Hang on. This this only goes to the entrance. I have to walk all the way up, okay. Let's get cozy. Wait, wait, what, huh? No, 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 no. Kinda just like went in there, Nam. As far as we can go, come on. It's a long path. My legs would be dead going up those stairs. We've made it to a new floor. I wonder what's in store for us. We've defeated so many enemies, there's nothing that can stop us now. I see those little alarm dudes. Right, Link? Go us! That's the spirit. Now, that's how a hero would sound. Okay, let's go. Hmm... Wait, are these the alarm floors? Uh oh. No, this isn't the sound floor. It's just the aesthetic. Run! Go on, skedaddle. They put that there so you know exactly how this stuff works. Yeah, let's kill those. I'm surprised Zelda didn't stop to explain to me how these guys work. But she's been doing that a ton. funky bridge. Hang on a second. Chat, have you been, have, have I been sounding clear today? I'm worried my microphone is a little bit weird. Oh, that's elevated. I need to be up to get that. Okay. Oh, great. Here we go. Sound is fine. Sound is fine. Okay, good. So I'm worried because I gotta keep leaning down to talk into the mic. Okay. <laughs> okay. I got a chest for one of those, though. Hang on, can I not get up to that one? There's a torch in the corner. 
Let me just mark that down there while I can. Uh-oh. Chad, they're gonna get me. They're coming to get me. Everything needs to be nice and cozy. No one can hurt us here. A chestnut. Or a wood heart. Those things can pop out of frickin' chests. Or, sorry, pots. That's weird. Yeah, I got a small key. Yeah, 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 you guys can't get me. Zelda's having the fun of her life. Yeah, I guess she is. Most of the Zeldas just kind of sit around doing nothing for several years. Link needs to do everything. Ah, oh, great. I'll take him out. Thank goodness they disappear quickly. I've got a way to go upstairs now, but what about... Um... I do need that tier of light, but what's upstairs? Is this a dead end first? Okay, the last tier of light is at the very end of that. And it's next to a phantom, so they expect me to get that last so I can hit the phantom. Let's go ahead and wait for these guys to get the hell out of here. So we're gonna go around and around and do what we need to do. Okay, that's that. I see. I see. Hang on. Those alarmy boys are gonna be real annoying, aren't they? No! Come on, go away. I tried to use the damn whip, and what happened? I fell. I fell. Let me see. Okay, got him. They're coming. They're gonna get me. We did the ocean temple, and then we uh, went to here. Wow, they can't get me. What a bunch of dorks. Okay, Whip does that. Nope. Now we're up over here. As soon as I go over there... Doesn't matter, because we have a safe zone here. Dude, they can't even fit here. What are they doing? Get out of here. Guess it was nothing. I love how all the phantoms have different designs on these floors, but, like, wasn't the whole thing about the phantoms and phantom hourglass, like, um... Hang on. They had different, like, uh, designs based on, like, how good they were. I think, like, a red, the red ones were, like, much faster or something. Thank you, Noob, for the sub there. I sure hope your cat's doing good. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's just wait for these guys to pop in and out now. We've taken care of all of that. Let's just go upstairs now. Normal phantoms, speedy phantoms, and teleporty phantoms. Okay. There's a chest down here, and there's an alarm guy inside. Let's do this. Hang on. Can this do that? Okay, that is a much better way of dealing with them.
Excellent. Master strategy. Oh, it looks like these guys respawn. In Phantom Hourglass, I remember that, um... If you, like, would kill all the alarm guys, it would make a chest appear. Don't get me. Oh, no, the door seals? <laughs> or I could just do that. Is that what I'm... Am I not supposed to do that? Because that seemed a little cheesy. Now that you've got all tears of light, your sword is full of energy. A chest would also appear, appear if you kill all the phantoms, yeah. But you can only kill the phantoms through very specific means, or unless you go there at the end of the game with, like, the strong sword that murders them. Now you can attack a phantom by hitting them in the back. Come on, Zelda. Time to get into your model. VTuber Zelda's here. Hey, check it out. I'm a warp phantom now. He... Oh, she does- she does get different abilities. That's good. You know those eyeball monster things? They're called phantom eyes. If you draw a line to a phantom eye, I can teleport straight there. Oh, that's why they need to respawn. That sounds so nice. I'll never have to walk anywhere again. And then kill it, because you can. If she's the only phantom here, though, does that mean... That should mean that the alarm guys can't even do anything on this floor, right? Except annoy the crap out of me. That sound they make is annoying, Jack. Yeah, get out of here. They're the same phantoms and phantom eyes, so does that mean Balum has some kind of influence over them, or what? No idea. It doesn't matter to me. Oh, hey, ancient gold piece. So now that we've gotten that... Hang on. We're gonna go downstairs, and we're gonna win. Because we need to use Zelda for this. Wait for me. Come on, Zelda. Pick up the pace, girl. Okay, so now that we've done that, I know what we need to do. We need to get Zelda to warp all the way over past this door, and we can't. Cool. Come on. Wait for me. Come on. Need to get that guy over there behind the wall. You did it! That's true. The phantoms were, um... The phantoms belonged to the Ocean King in Phantom Hourglass. Balum took them over. Which means the fan if the phantoms are here, that means whatever similar entity. Maybe the Ocean King was responsible for the Tower of Spirits as well? Or maybe they were just reusing the asset and we don't need to think about it too hard. That's probably the case. Okay. Okay, there's that. What else is here? I think Link... Oh, right, the small key. Wait, do I even have that anymore? I'll just stop that. I used a small key to go upstairs. The other phantom warped here. No problem. Okay, we, got to, we just gotta find another chest, but maybe Zelda's supposed to be used for that. Wait a second. Hang on. This is sealed by the door. She has no way of warping to it, right? No, she does. She can't. Can't 
can't go upstairs for that, can we? I am a little confused right now. Hang on a second. Do, did I, like, miss a chest upstairs? Because I only see those big white chests that have, like, nothing. Don't leave without me. I'm trying not to, but you're all the way over there. I'm gonna try poking my head upstairs again and see if there's another key that I just easily missed. Come on. Come on, Zelda. What? Why is she going over there? Huh? I... Zelda? Zelda. I would love to know why calling her from this corner is telling her to continue all the way to the other end of the room. Chad, I broke her. I broke the princess again. Yeah, warp over here. Now, I know I'm not doing anything wrong right there. That's the game's fault, right? Mr. Miyamoto himself did it. He came to my he came to my home and he sabotaged my copy. Okay. Yeah, I think there's still something we can do down there, but there's no Wait, no, we can't get down there. We have to go from the the stairs in the corner, but which you can only access by hitting those switches which require the small key, which means How the hell do I get that? Ah? Huh? Okay, so we have to find the chest down here. I do not have a small <clears throat> a small key. We already used it up. So I gotta look for something here. It's too hot to chase intruders. Don't attack Zelda. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hmm. Oh no. Hang on. Can I reach this one? It wouldn't let me before. No, it's too high up. I don't have a way of setting that on fire. Wait, no, Zelda can, like, get her sword on fire, can't she? Right, she could do that, if I remember correctly. Uh-oh. Here, let's just wait for her to do her thing. No, is that not something she could do? How did she light her sword on fire? I'm losing my mind. No, she can't. Hang on, can my boomerang reach it, or do I need to be elevated? I actually can't remember. Maybe I'm just overthinking it. Here, get in this one. The phantom we took was from upstairs, so this should eliminate one of them, right? Okay, I need you to stand out of the way over here. Oh. You know what the issue was there? <sighs> My brain thought I needed to be, like, on an elevated surface, like, on top of her shield to hit that torch. I don't know why. I don't know why, but I just thought that for some reason. Well, that wasted a bunch of time for no, no good reason. Let's do it. Hang on, I gotta wait for this thing to go. Yeah, she was, there, she was a specific phantom that could do that before. This should be the key. I was probably thinking of that because of the snake hook, yeah. Okay, now that we've done that, Zelda can teleport to this one over here. I said, Zelda can teleport to... Oh my god, no, 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 no. Not that one. Come on, Zelda, you can do it. Uh-oh. He responded, he's trying to get me. Now 
now he's gone. All right, let's wait for this boy to go away. Getting confused or not, it definitely feels like the Spirit Temple is much more, like, lighter with its puzzles, I almost feel like. I feel like you have to do a lot more annoying, complicated stuff for some floors. I'm not even talking about the fact, like... Oh, damn it. I'm not even talking about having to replay, too. I kind of hate that these guys respawn. Well, he walked in the safe zone. I guess we can't get him no more, Timmy. Ah, oh, damn. He's gonna get in the way. No. No! Wait, what? They, they were both green. They they were both green a second ago. Don't don't even give me that. They were both green. You all saw it. Oh, I had to hit it a few more times, though. All right, let's just wait for these guys to move so I can get my ass out of here. All right. Zelda, get your ass over here. Come on. <laughs> Floor 14. She could just barely fit through that stairwell, too. No, no, I'm, I'm trying to... I'm trying to move myself, and I'm drawing Zelda's path because she's too close. All right, you call. We're almost there, I think. Yeah, she could just hit him on her own, on her own if she gets close enough to it. You go stand on that. Zelda can't walk on the sand, can she? That's probably what the issue would be. Not waste any time and let her fall in. She can walk over the spikes because she got armor. Okay. What's that? Okay. Now I think I need to stand on this. Oh? Oh, it's a little swapsy thing. Okay, then. We'll use this now. Okay. Stand a little further back from those things. Oh, Teddy. Is Zelda gonna come this way? All right, let's just set the thing down and let her... She can't figure it out. She's trying to go through the wall. Her pathing for the auto call is very weird. It's like it treats some rubes like this. There's like some big open thing, and so she thinks she could just walk through the wall. Okay, there's still more. There's two phantoms sealed in the corner, which means they're only going to show up when I activate the dude. I'm guessing I should stand here and have Zelda branch, branch out and look around. Oh. Oh, there's multiple. Oh, okay. Hang on. Let's uh, start with this one, because I can see a clear path then. Okay. This will get Link on the other side of the spikes. We'll see if that's something. This is a very confusing place. At least you don't have to replay everything from the first floor every time. Again, I never had a big issue with that, but I know many people despise that about Phantom Hourglass. Okay. Ouch. 
Whip does nothing. Zelda can't go over the sand. Aha! Took your shield. Oh, the whip just makes these guys so much more easier now. That's perfect. I hate running around these guys, even in Phantom Hourglass. I can pick this up and throw it. Guess I need two people to open that door, maybe. Yeah. I need to push this block because Zelda won't be able to go through it, right? But is there a place I can push it onto? Square there. Oh, I gotta push it on one of those switches. I get it. I get it. What floor is this? Uh, can I check the map here? Floor 15. This is a pretty tall tower. Excellent. Okay. I don't think... Of all the Zelda games, I don't think these ones are really getting ROM hacks. That would take quite a lot of extra work, especially knowing that there's quite a lot of extra setup for anybody to even properly play these games. Okay, spikes are gone down there. There's a lot of Link to the Past ones I'd love to give a try. I don't know if there's any for Minish Cap, though, outside of um, the randomizer tool. Again, I still want to give a big try someday. Would it be- is there even a point of bringing Zelda over here? Is it so she can reach the door? Yeah, it is. Absolutely. Okay, hang on then. We'll go stand there, and we'll go bring her here. Yay. Zelda hacks can be cool. Because they actually make the combat not a joke. No, they either make combat uh, hard, or they make it combat annoying as hell. Let me see here. Um. Yeah, you go there. And Link will go ahead and... Wait, th why the spike's gone? Huh? Oh, oh, that's... Hang on, hang on. I thought that was permanent. I need to do this. <coughs> I need a drink. I gasped, and I hiccuped a little bit. Streamer is hurt. Go oh, by the way. Okay. I don't trust calling Zelda. She will not listen very well. So we'll do this for a second. I drink and posture check. Don't worry, I will. You know what? However, chat, in order to stretch, I have to get rid of the bear. You can't stretch with a teddy bear on your lap. Ugh. Stretch too? Sure, I can do that. Aw, oh, poor Teddy. He's he's gone. He'll be back though. He's just going to get a snack. Small key. Everybody loves the frickin' moral support bear. It's great. I've got Teddy Ursa plushies as moral support. Always great stuff. Okay, I'm gonna call you now. And how the hell do I... This is how I get Zelda on top like that. I see. I see. We got the small key. Now I need to do all of this. That's another reason the phantoms are sealed up like that. They don't want me to abuse, like, switching Zelda to Quick Warper, don't they? Okay. I need Zelda back to the hub area. Let's do this. Now, because the spikes are there, I need to go all the way back to this one. Now it's a whole lot of damn work for a small key. Wait, what am I saying? I could just hop down here. And I should probably get on top of her shield. I don't know the significance of this yet, but it seems like it's important. Was there something over here I needed to do this for? Let's find out. Zelda's trying her best. Yeah, well, her best is not good enough. I try my best. 
What does that get me? Hi, Mina. Thank you for the raid. Welcome. Okay, let's go over here. Is there anything over here that needs... Requires me to be elevated? I do not know. We're too high up for that to do anything. I don't think there was a point to doing that. I don't think I needed to ride the shield. I think that was just a hop down. Hang on. Okay, you're blocking the way there. Hmm. I think I understand what I need to do. I need Zelda to warp over to this guy. Nope, stop that. And then I need to get Zelda to this thing right here. So that we can swap and get Link over there. No, 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 no. Come on. We did it. Look at that. Alright. However, we can't do that because there's quicksand there. Oh, right. If that's the case, there's nothing over here. Oh, no, there's nothing over here. There was no point to that. Wait, wait, wait. I think I know what to do. I think I know what to do. I think that's what the switch is for. Yay! Easy. And now there's a bunch of boulders over this way. And the boulders hurt Zelda. Okay. She can stop them because she's powerful. Oh no! They knocked her over. That's sad. Okay. So we need both of them on that. Hmm. Okay, the spikes are down. Of course it does that. These last few floors are, like, a lot more annoying for sure. Nothing over here. Okay, so we can swap this way. And then what do I do? The bridge stays there, so I can get Zelda to warp over there again after Link gets that way. Okay, let's do that. My sword is honey glazed. Bears like it. Welcome home, friend. How you doing? We beat the third temple, and now I'm back at the Temple of Spirits, or Tower of Spirits. Okay. This is a little bit tedious, but I know what to do. Zelda can teleport to the eyeballs, because that's what she does. Okay, this path should work for us. Don't be silly and fall off. Ooh. Oh, pardon me there. A little bit. I need to, like, rub my eyes a little bit. Okay, I'm a genius. I figured it out. Now then. I need Zelda to block the boulders. That's what I need her to do. So Link can get past this. going. It's a little annoying, but we can do it. Okay, we made it. Now we're gonna draw this right here for Zelda. Or sorry, yeah. No, I had that right. What am I saying? We opened the way back. Um... The significance of that is what? What did I do that for? Link can go up here. Yeah. 
Link's the only one that can get over this way. Uh-oh. Wait. Wait, there's two switches, but Zelda can't get over here. They're trapped up there. Hmm. Uh-oh. I don't think you can just, like... Am I supposed to lure the eye over here and then hit one of the phantoms to, like, make Zelda take over it? Or maybe just, like, have her teleport to it? I... Mm, let, let me see, let me see, let me see. I've been... Oh, sorry, guys. I killed Zelda. My bad. Happens to the best of us. Happens when you're in Hyrule a lot, from what I understand. Okay. Will this really work? Ah, damn it! Wait, no, she's still there! Oh my god, it worked. <laughs> there is no way that's the intended way to solve the puzzle, is it? There's no way. What? That... Th this does not seem right. That, that seems so unbelievably crusty, but it worked. Sort of, but also no. Really? What's what's the intended way? Because I don't- I couldn't really see any other way of doing that. Uh-oh. Okay, take those guys out. Nope, can't get me. We got the small key, so we can go this way. See. Did the boulders have no the boulders can't reach anything before another boulder breaks it. There's no way. You have to boomerang the eye, blow it across the sand, and then get Zelda to warp to it. Oh, well, my way also worked just fine. <laughs> I never would have thought of that. My way worked just fine. Wait, we're still not at the top? Hold, this section goes on and on forever. Holy crap. Okay, then. What's this say? Move from the green tile to the red tile. Your path will form a special symbol. Okay. Where's the way in? You can warp there. Move from the green tile to the red tile. Help if I could, like... Actually look at it. Where's the red tile? Uh-oh. Okay. I guess I now need to know what the symbol is. Looks like only Zelda can get over there. Try this then. Let's let's figure this out. My way of playing the game is to do the correct thing, but in the funnier way. Exactly, exactly. Hmm. Hmm. So we went over here. Am I supposed to, like, make, uh, th this symbol in this room, or what? I- the path I'm walking has a special meaning. Oh, no, it is. Oh, no, I gotta follow the phantom, I do. Oh, no. Alright, chat, let's- Let's get started. Let's start. I think he walked like this, right? Or does he start from the center? 
What? Now he's what? No, but that's where the red tile is. What? That doesn't make any sense. You've already broken the logic. Can't start from that corner to that corner. That's literally what I just did. All right, let's just let him get back to start. Go back to start, buddy. Okay, he's going down first. He's going down first. Let's sit here and watch him. Da -da -da. Um... Okay, so I caught him in the middle there, did I? So it goes down, up. Oh no, he's going further up. Okay. Is he making an arrow? Let's find out. Even how Zelda presses on the tiles, I feel like this has to be pretty generous to work. Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Then he's gonna go back to the red tile. Er, let's see. Now he's going back to the start position, okay. I think we got it, chat. I think we got it. I mentioned- I think I mentioned last time I was playing this, I was watching speedrun videos, but like... There's like no speedrun videos on like Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks. I would love to see like a summoning salt style video on like the world record history and just learn about all the funny time saves in Phantom Hourglass. That'd be funny. Okay, first was down. Then we go up like this. Let's find out if this works. That'd be awesome. I don't know about any... Oh, come on, Zelda. Come on, come on. I don't know about any glitches in these games. Maybe I made some happen that I don't remember, though. You, I feel like games... Like, how strangely these games are built, they'd be ripe with glitches. Seeing how things like Majora and Ocarina of Time are, but, like, I don't know. It worked. Oh boy. All right. Now, uh, uh oh, I have to have Zelda walk all the way around that because she can't immediately teleport to Link. Let's go here. All right, I think we finally hit the end. Are those squares orange for a frame? I don't think I saw that. I know that the speed run for Wind Waker is interesting. Uh, the any percent glitch one, though. That's the one where you just, bi like, build up an amount of, like, hypercharged speed in the ocean, and you just zip across the entire map. That's the only one I know. I don't know about, like, the, the non-glitch one. I feel like that skip is so major that there's probably categories that specifically don't do that one. Because I imagine it would get old for people fast if they only played that way. All right, we did that. We're finally done here for the day. You got the fire rail map. Ooh. Am I still making good pace? Do you guys think I could probably beat this next stream? Some of the lost spirit tracks are on it reappearing. 
I feel like the main reason this game is sh probably feels shorter is because Phantom Hourglass makes you replay parts of the Ocean King Temple. For sure. So this is your handiwork, is it? Uh-oh, chat. I think there's about to be bad guys. You know what that means. I need a Teddy for moral support. Oh, no! Restoring the spirit tracks. Rebuilding this tower. You two were behind it all, weren't you? You didn't have to come to this, you know? If you just minded your own business, minded your own business, you killed me. I'm trying to get, get her body back. Stop, burn. How did you get up here? I always suspected this day would come. Indeed, I have a premonition of the day you left the tower. No matter how many times I corrected your behavior, you never were very good at listening, were you? You were an unworthy apprentice. Dot, dot, dot. And now look at you. How can I face the spirits of good? The spirits sent us here to continue their work. That you would try to resurrect the Demon King is unfathomable to me. I have no wish to continue the work of spirits. Why would I want to serve the spirits when I can become as powerful as they are? That was the reason I came to study with you. But the spirits never answered me. No matter how hard I worked or how long, they never granted me any more powers. Tell me, Master, when you realize that your wish will never be granted, what do you do then? The answer was clear. Become even more powerful than the spirits themselves. And the only being more powerful is Maladus. <sighs> Your thoughts are twisted. It's obvious that the time for saving you is past. My words would only be lost on you. Hurry to the Fire Temple, Your Highness, quickly. You too, Link. Restore the spirit tracks. <laughs> But Anjin, go, I will handle this situation. So is Burn a locomo and he has like a mechanical arm instead of like uh, like a little, little wheelchair go-kart thing? Now then, shall we begin? Oh, she's gonna fight him. Perhaps this time things will be different. Oh, come, no, don't cut away, I wanna see this. Oh, we're not gonna see it. That that costs too much animation budget. Oh, we're gonna die. Ow. I can't believe Link is freaking dead too. Are are you all right there, Link? <laughs> Ow, I gasped a little too hard there. But Anjin, she's up there all by herself now. I guess we gotta believe she'll be okay. Let's do as she said and go to the fire temple. We must hurry to restore the spirit tracks in time. <laughs> we did it. Link is just still along for the ride. That's what it feels like. We have to go to the final temple and restore the last of the spirit tracks. We must hurry there, for Anjin's sake. Let's go. I saw the rail map for the Fire Realm. New tracks have appeared to connect the Fire Realm and the Snow Realm. What realm should we go to? Snow, of course. I don't really feel like going all the way back to other areas right now. I don't have enough rupees for that one heart container, right? That was 2,000. All right. Gotta get going, friend. All right, catch you later. Show that you care, spam little bears. I wonder if there's just some ridiculous warp in these games that just completely breaks everything. Hang on a second. No! I wanted to check my rupees, you stupid jerk. 
Canceling that put me back in the temple. I don't even have half the amount for that heart container. Whatever. I'm not even gonna go get the shield. I don't even care. I don't even care. Heck no, I don't want to backtrack. It's right here. Toot the horn. Toot. Daddy loves when I toot the horn. There we go. Yay, fire area. It's not Death Mountain. It may or may not become Death Mountain in the future. These mountains sure are steep. Phew! Uh-oh. Whoa, what in the... Oh no, watch out. Toots. Well, looks like there's two places to go. I say the town is probably the first bet. Do, 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 do. Teddy needs a break. He's going to, he's going to make more snacks. Uh-oh. Watch out for that stuff. Probably could stop by the bunny guy another time, but really steep. Hope the train will be okay. It'll be just fine, Zelda, don't worry. Everything is looking just fine. There's a little tunnel here. It demands I toot the horn. Is there any reason to ever follow any of the signs, or are they just aesthetic for that one part? stop at this place. What is it? Goron Village. Hey, check it out. The Gorons. We we took them with us from the Phantom Hourglass land. They gotta live too. They're just for escort missions. There's several side quests for uh, escorting people. Pardon me for, for thinking so, but I don't think I really want to do side quests in this game. You can say that about, like, almost every Zelda game. And, like, Majora's Mask is probably, like, the only fun one to do it to 100% side quests in. This village looks like it's seen better days. I wonder if there's anything we can do to help. But first things first, let's... We must know where this realm's locomo is. Almost forgot I gotta do the spear flute again. Why don't we chat with the villagers? I don't think there's a single person on planet Earth that will sit there with a straight face and say, Boy, I sure did have fun collecting all the gold sculptures in Ocarina of Time. Absolutely the highlight of every Zelda experience. Can't wait to do it again. Why don't they ever bring it back? Goron Country Store up ahead. The eruption was so loud it hurt my ears. I hope Gramps is okay. I need to get to the village so we can check on him. Greetings, stranger. The last eruption blocked the way into the village. I fear the mountain goddess must be very angry. Your face is unfamiliar to me, stranger. Have you come to visit our village? Yes. Well, either way, you cannot get there, stranger. You see, the lava from the last eruption has destroyed the way into the village. If you have important business here, you must go to see uh, Kagoron. Follow that road up and you will find him. Algaron is the mountain goddess's messenger. He is praying at her altar for a stop to the volcano's outbursts. If you decide to go to the altar, be very careful. Because of the eruptions, the path there is paved with danger. Sick. I love danger. Path to the altar of the mountain goddess. Hang on, there's a hut over there. It could be a shop or something. Let me go have a look at that. Yeah, it is a shop. Oh, I can buy a shield again. Many fine items, my good chum. 200 rupees? Oh, take your freaking filthy money.
Thanks, come again. What a damn shield to get over. Can't believe I'm getting ripped off here. How mean. Well, is what it is. Let's go this way. At least I got a shield. If there are like likes up ahead. This isn't Goron Village. Lies. No. The Goron Iron we mine here in this village is famous for its strength. But it does have one weakness. Lava. That sounds like a bit of a hassle of an oversight when you're living here, isn't it? Okay, looks like I can't get through that. Can I go around you? Oh, I can. A Stalfos skull. No Stalfos in the game, but Stalfos skulls are here. Let me see. Is there really enough? Oh, I can just fit there, actually. Okay, I was gonna say, it looked like I couldn't get through that for a sec. Yeah, yeah, get in there. Ow. Damn it. You're good, Link. Just keep going. I can cheese through it. Easy enough. That was a very delayed switch right there. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. Uh-oh. Hang on, I need to clear a path to that. Let me get this right here. I'll happily take these, but hang on. Wait, how do I... Oh, silly me. I miss I was looking at the map wrong when I hit that. Oh, never mind. It's on the elevated part. Then how the hell do I get up there? What Oh, wait. I see it. I see it. There's grappling hook things over there. <sighs> I didn't even notice those. Did you guys? Or some of you have. Go, 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 go. Just enough time to make it. Shortcut back down the mountain. Okay, well, I don't need to do that. I need to go down this way. Whoa. You're an unusual looking Goron. He's Ka Goron. Hmm? Who is this strange face before me? This is a sacred place of the Gorons. You cannot just come here on a whim. Mm, I see you are still a child. Tell me, did you travel here by yourself? I must salute your bravery, young stranger. Tell me, is there something you wish to discuss? Actually... You wish to hear about the fire sanctuary? Unfortunately, the way there is hidden to us. Only the Elder would be able to tell you that secret. Do you wish to meet, to meet him? Yes, I thought you were the Elder. Good, good. Nice to see some young people with some spine. The Elder is in the village and there's a way to get there. But first, you are an engineer, are you not? Uh, why? Those who drive trains have a special aura about them. I can see it in you. But moving on, your train may come in handy. But let us descend the mountain so we can speak in peace. Uh, I have some work to do first, so I will meet you down there. You go ahead and get your train ready. All right, then. Oh, no, this is an escort mission, isn't it? It probably is. What am I, taxi service? Ugh. Shortcut down the mountain this way, they said. Uh. Oh, wait, no, I can see him on the map. The grappling hook things are on the map. See why they put them there. They blend into me so easily. Got a Rudo crown. What's a Zora? Yeah, 
now that I'm thinking about that, hey, hang on a second. Chat, chat, chat. Come on now. Where, where, where is the collection thing again? Oh, here it is. Some say this regal regal crown was worn by generations of Zora princes. What's a Zora? The Zoras are extinct in this timeline. <laughs> why do they? Why do they know that? Alrighty. I should be able to reach another chest over this way, can I? There's boulders here. Well, no big deal. I go down this way. There it is. We got the pirate necklace. Zora's arguably had it the rough with the great had, had it like the roughest with the great flood. The gods were literally like, hey, we can't have the Zoras telling people about the kingdom at the bottom of the ocean. You guys are birds now. Deal with it. <laughs> oh man. The gods in Hyrule kind of suck, don't they? Hagaron, why have you left the altar? Heck yeah, we're comfy right now. Oh, I was thinking of giving a freight car to this child, and I need your help. If you say so, Kagaron, I have no complaint. I don't think the gods of Hyrule really thought that far ahead. See, we had to do it. We had to stop Ganondorf, and then Ganondorf comes back anyway, and they were just like, oopsie whoopsie. Um, you guys can go find a new land, right? How about this one? Look, it's got it's got train tracks. Isn't that cool? And that don't you guys like that? Aren't we aren't we so generous? Aren't we just so great to you guys? Oh yeah, we never let you guys down. This is the favor I require of you, young stranger. Use the freight car to bring back something that's cold enough to cool the lava. Oh, that's a great idea. Yeah, let me just let me just go grab a bunch of snow, haul it back to the volcano. It'll be frozen for sure. Go talk to merchants in various. Oh no! <sighs> they may be able to help you. All right then. Time to be an engineer. That's what I signed up for. At least it's not an escort mission. Something cold, hmm? I know where to get something cold. Right. Please drive safely. Okay, yeah, let's get something cold. Doing my job? Ridiculous nonsense. Well, let's go to Snow Realm. Boop, 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 boop. Toot the horn! I haven't gotten Beetle to stop near me, like, once. He's always, like, on the other damn side of the map. I don't even want to bother with him. Hydrate and posture check. Yes, sir. -y. Let's do it. Mm. Oh, boy. What about Zora's outside of Hyrule? See... Outside of Hyrule is a is this mystical land of it kind of doesn't exist, which is weird. Like, um, do the do the kingdoms in Oracle of Seasons and Ages even actually like are they even real? I wasn't quite clear on that. I think they are. Termina is not real, which is still weird. They don't make that clear at all. I guess those places are okay. But wait a second, if they had to flood Hyrule, that means now everywhere else had to be flooded too, so... I think the gods are showing a little bit of favoritism there, you think? Alright, to the snowy realm. Okay, we're right here. I guess we'll go to Anelki Village. That should work out. See if we can get stuff along the way. We had to protect the Triforce. We had to destroy the whole world, not just Hyrule.
chat, I get the feeling it would suck to live in the, the Hyrule universe, or the Zelda universe. Let me just live my life when everything's peaceful. I don't want to deal with all this, like, world dying stuff. That's not my problem. Yeah, there's monsters everywhere. It's totally rude of them, too. Maybe before I, I go back, I should drop the bunnies off the bunny guy. Who knows, maybe I'll get like 30, 10 rupees for it. Don't worry, we just gotta go through here. Hyrule is peaceful when Ganon's not around. Is it a cool place to live? I don't know. Pop this over here. That elephant thing. Haven't seen any funny bunnies yet. Speak of the devil. Bunny acquired. You got a snow rabbit. Chat, why must bunnies look so huggable? Why must they be so angry at humans? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Bunnies and bears are very wholesome. Alright, let's stop at the village and see what people are up to. Toot toot! Oh hey, I, all my notes are still there. Hey there, little guy! I know we don't get any lumber around these parts, and we don't really got anyone with the know-how to build a fence. Tell me you're not gonna make me do a trade quest. So listen, do you think you could bring us some- Why? Why are you gonna make me do this? Chain of deals! Could you bring us both lumber and a handyman? We'd be eternally grateful. Wait, where the hell did y'all come from? How you doing, guy? You need something? Ice. Ice, hmm? Is that what the kids are calling it now? Well, in a chilly place like this, you figure there'd be at least a little lying around. Lucky for you, though, we got a fine local product called Mega Ice. Take a look at this. This stuff living... Uh, the guy living right here makes the stuff. He can help you out. Just don't expect to get it for free. It'll probably cost you. Wait, wait. So I don't have to do this? Is this guy, like, stuck? He is. Weather's so nice, but it figures I'd get stuck with guard duty. Won't someone please give me a break? Okay, so maybe he's a side quest. Maybe I don't have to do that. Hey there, little guy. So you got yourself a passenger car now. It's fate, I tell you. What's that? You say you've had it for a while. Well, that's news to me. Think you could give me a lift to a cold, clear spring? Why? Why, you ask? Well, listen to this crazy story. You know how we sell Mega Ice here? Yeah, it's our village's major export. Well, a little while ago, an ice choo-choo fell in the water. Ever since, there's been a gooey film floating on the surface. It's revolting. If we made Mega Ice out of this water, our customers would never come back. So please, you gotta take me to a lake or some other body of water. And it's gotta be in a cold place, cause you can't make ice without the cold. Well, you're gonna take me, aren't ya? I, I think I know where to go. Thank you kindly. I owe you one guy. Okay, I'll be waiting for you on your train. Oh, this is worse. Alright. Is there anything else I can get around here, though? I see a torch over there, actually. Hang on.
Damn it. Okay, that's fine. That pays for half my damn shield. Come on, it's gonna break. Guess not. Lasted a while there. How many rupees I got? Six, six, six. That's a good sign. Is there anything else like anything else I can get here with the current set of items? Maybe. Oh, stamp thing. When I get the chance, I should see Nico again and maybe get stuff. Yes. Okay. Well, that's that. No need to really roll against stuff in this game. Well. Oh, uh, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Are you ready to go? This isn't far. We should be okay. Clearly, he wants to go to that. I don't know if it's a good idea to go for Beetle right now. All right, let's follow the traffic laws, everybody. Let's be let's be complete freaking weenies. That's what we're gonna do. Quick, how do I call Beetle again? If I can make it happen, I think I just whistle at him. Okay, good. I caught his attention. Let me see if I can get anything from him. Um, I'm sorry. Oh no, do I have to actually go over to him? All right, come on, a little closer. Beetle shop ship is back. I see a heart container back there, boyo. Oh, valued customer, we have everything you need at Beetle's Air Shop, except shirts. What can I interest you in? Is that a bomb bag? Huh? Wait, 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 wait. This isn't a dungeon item? It's optional in this game? Oh, wow. That That's weird. If I buy this, I'm not going to get even close to that heart container anymore, but... I, I kind of don't care. I kind of want the bomb bag. You got bombs. They can come with a bomb bag. Hold up to that. Tap that there. Treasure, palace dish, thousand rupees. You can't beat that price. Well, I'll take it. Oh, I see you haven't joined Beatles Members Club. There are lots of great benefits to joining Beetle Member Club, and it's just 100 rupees to join. Bro, don't try to upsell me on this crap. You know I'm not going to be here enough. Bye, come again. I want that. Oh, valued customer, we have everything you need at Beetle's Air Shop. Oh, I, I want that, though. Can't just put that there. You know I want it. Maybe I gotta tap a certain angle for it. No. Well, he's just gonna tease me with it. I'm sure it's a membership reward, but I ain't gonna farm the rupees for that. Ugh. Alright, whatever. We took care of that crap. Oops, did I hit Beetle Shop Ship? Oops. My train is stuck going in reverse now. Hang on, I need to just correct it by doing this. Let's do it. Did I miss a stretch? Oh, you're right, I did. Oof. All right. Uh-oh, hang on. <laughs> It seems like I could do some side quests in this game, but I feel like I don't- it, they're really gonna be unnecessary. 
It'll be a lot of extra work just for like an extra heart container. Um, excuse me? Why is it still... Huh? Bro, are you serious? Oh. All right, then. I need to turn the train around. Let's reverse this boy. And... Are, are you serious? That's not what I put in! Why won't you turn? That's not what I drew! Oh my god, go over here. All right, then. We're gonna go further down this, and you're gonna turn. There, is that far enough? It damn well better be. The track won't turn that way. Like, you all can see that, right? Like, the track will not turn. <laughs> turn! Why do you keep going straight? I'm trying! It won't turn! Come on! Okay. That's the issue. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. The boat didn't have these problems. There, there, go. All right, all right, all right. Now let's just keep going. Speed up. Don't need to break no signs. Uh oh. All right, let's go this way. Sometimes all we need is a wholesome teddy bear to make our day better. In fact, you know what? Bear has been summoned. Where is it? Wait, where? Those little jerks. Ooh, get out of the way! <laughs> Oh, I'm dead. Oh! Yeah, 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 I get it. Load it again. No one cares. <laughs> All that garbage because I needed to visit Beetle's scam ship. Let's try this again, camera. Turn, please. All right, I'm going to go right to fast mode. It doesn't seem like there's any signs along the way. All right, got him. Watch for the snowman. Do I have the bomb bag? I damn well better. See, I'm tapping the snowman's body, but it keeps going like well over their head. Uh, hang on. Yeah, I still have the bomb bag, that's good. If I didn't, I would have been very pissy. Oh man. There's no signs here. We're A-OK. -okay. And this guy better not get fussy with me while I'm trying to give him a lift here. Nope, camera! That's why I don't like the snow guys showing up at the, uh, the turn. Because the camera forcibly turns there whether you're touchscreening it or not. 
Okay. I know where they're gonna be now, so I can just turn to it fast enough. Okay, we're almost there. Oh. Have I made a save lately? Maybe. Look, there's a save. It happened lately. You can't say I didn't now. Trying to catch me in, in a bit of a issue there? I don't think so. Oh no! Quickly, quickly. Let's stop. Not bad, guy. Our train is going to get rammed and killed, but it's fine. Oh, that looks like a nice place for Mega Ice over there. We did it. Why did that short train ride just become, like, absolutely frustrating as all hell? Whatever. Oh, yeah, this is a prime spot for making Mega Ice for- or what? Yep, this is it. I'm gonna start up the business right here. Oh, Force Gem. Wait, does that mean... No, this is what I have to do, because he's the guy who's like, wants stuff, right? Oh, a new way to connect to the forest, that's good. Force Gem has energized the rail map, new tracks have appeared. Okay, time to make the Mega Ice. Sorry, could you come back in a bit? There are certain company secrets I don't want revealed to the public. Before that, though, I should be able to... Yeah, get me. Get that stamp now. I see how to get it too. What's this? Ooh, a hundred rupees. You see that crap, Teddy? Teddy sees this crap. Ouch. Come on now. Put this in, stamp station. Yes, I will stamp it. Yeah, that guy's face is here for some reason. All right, now that we've done that, don't think there's anything else really here to grab. Wait, maybe I just go in and out of the house. Maybe that'll work better. Hey guys, so about that slick little freight car you got. Why not load it up with some of our fine local mega ice? How about it? The ladies go wild for it. I'll even cut you a special deal. Ladies go wild for ice? Is that all it takes? Is this what they mean about playing it cool? I'll even cut you a special deal. Special deal? Bro, I helped you make this stuff. You could at least slip, slip me a little freebie. 25 rupees? Okay, sure, whatever. Pleasure doing business with you. Let me know if you ever need more. Oh, I'll even load up your freight car for you. How's that for service? Now that's a now that's a good time to let you know that some things about handling the product. First, don't hit anything or let the train sway when the ice is loaded on. If you do, the ice will spill everywhere. Also, watch out for monster attacks. Second, you're carrying ice, pal, so naturally it's gonna melt, yeah? In nice chilly places like this, you won't have to worry. Once you travel to warmer places, it'll start melting before long. Get to where you're going before the ice runs out. You don't. Be prepared to say bye-bye to all the ice. Alright, let's give this a try. I guess I can't really go back to the forest right now. We'll have to do this. Does that mean I gotta slow down for corners now? Probably. Are you ready to leave? I'll try my best. Mm-hmm. I got the bomb bag, I can say that. I got the bombs. Okay, um... That bomb rail guy is going around like that, so maybe I should do this. Wait, this guy wanted the bridge worker at the Anauki village. Maybe I should do that later? Maybe. ba 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 ba, -ba.
Good thing popping stuff with my cannon doesn't matter. Alright, let's do that. Try the stupid thing. Oh crap, where? Where? Dude, come on. <sighs> the sign blocked my cannon. Okay, let's be careful. We're almost to a straightaway, so let's wait for that first. It's nice and chilly here, chat. Do you think a cup of hot cocoa would be very nice right now? I think some cocoa would be nice and dandy at the moment. All right, I'm not letting it get to me. I'm not letting it get to me. See, when I'm doing the train stuff, y'all can't see the spots on the screen where I'm tapping. I swear, when it when it looks like I'm not doing the right thing, I swear I ta I'm tapping the right thing. It just like. It, it just... It's a DS game. That's all I really need to say. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, I'm doomed. <laughs> well, that one was my fault. I didn't look at the map to see where he was coming. All right. I thought he turned the other way. Damn it. Where is he at? Okay. If I, like, just follow behind him, maybe I'll be all right. I t I got 20 ice again, that's cool. If we just go at moderate speed, we'll be okay. <laughs> Arma for killing the villager, I didn't kill anybody. That would, I would be arrested for that. <laughs> that requires evidence. Cool. Unbelievable, streamer. You spilled the ice in the train game. This is literally unwatchable now. <laughs> I was more focused on, on the train. I didn't even realize the bomb train was coming towards me. Hang on, it's safe to speed up a little bit. He's gonna get around. Holy crap, he's actually decently fast, isn't he? Uh-oh. Is he going the same way I am? Uh-oh. Yeah, he's coming for me. Toot the horn! Toot the horns! The elephant's the most awkward to hit. Ah, oh, two of them! Three of them! Hit them! Are you serious? Oh. That's so lame, man. Oh, I'm tapping the freaking sign. No, I'm tapping the elephant. I'm... It won't hit them. <laughs> oh, and I couldn't... It wouldn't even let me turn to get that guy behind me, too. All right, let's just hope this is enough. And the bomb guy is coming. Of... Of course he's coming directly for me. Let me see if he's gonna turn first. He's not moving. He's 100% waiting there, so I have to take the long path, isn't he? Oh! <laughs> Having elephant with elephants? No, thank you. I am having no fun with these. I have to go fast now. I don't even think this is possible anymore. No! Dude, how did I hit the sign? Hit, hit the thing. Hit the thing. Oh, I'm losing my mind. All right. Let's see if I can get there fast enough before it melts. 
I don't think I have a cho a any choice but to go at full speed. Okay, here's what we're gonna need to do. Let's do it. <laughs> I can do it. I'm a big boy. I got an engineer degree. You can't tell me I don't. All right, here we go. Go fast. Are we gonna make it? Please tell me we're gonna make it. If one of my cannon shots gets blocked by another freaking train sign. Wait, oh, you can stun them after three cannon shots? Damn. I guess that's what the, the iron one was different for. Okay. What? What? No, turn! Oh, this is ass! Oh, come on, man. Here we go. I don't know, I think the Wii U touchscreen is just fine for this, but if you say it's it's weird compared to DS for these parts, I'll trust you. Come on. See? I made it. What were you all worried about? We looks like we made it somehow. Why are we such... No, that's not the princess like to say. Come on, let's find Kagurod and tell him about the ice. Chat. Chat, were you doubting me? Why on earth would you doubt me when I told you? I have an engineer certificate. Engineer certificate! I am more- Do you have an engineer certificate right now? No. Who's qualified to drive the train? Who got here with the ice? Exactly. Now let's never do that again. <laughs> Even we Gorons cannot defeat the lava. I'm afraid we're not much help. Is that your train? Is it look- it is looking good. Damn right it is. Uh... How do I, like, use the ice? I wonder what he- WHY IS IT STILL MELTING?! WHY IS IT STILL MELTING?! HOW DO I USE IT?! WHAT?! IT'S RIGHT THERE! Are you serious? No! You piece of crap, why couldn't you stand closer? <sighs> I have an idea. The lava's not damaging me. Come on. Reset the map. Why would it still melt like this? Why, why the hell is he standing over there? I couldn't find him. I was so pissed off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please tell me this worked. <laughs> bitch! Oh, wonderful. We can use it to chill the lava that's separating us from the village. Chat. Certificate. This is the difference between people who have a certificate. I can't believe that worked. I mean, I, I of course it worked. We can use it to chill the lava that is separating us from the village. Come on, help everybody. Come help me move this off the train. I told you I solve every puzzle because I'm engineer certified. <laughs> How did I get away with this exactly? All I had to do was just bomb myself a little bit. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Thank you. You should go meet the elder. His house is at the northernmost part of the map. 
Holy moly. Let me... Let, hang on, you're right. I need a drink. Let me just set the game pad aside for a second. I need some... I have some fizzy water left. That was by far one of the most annoying parts so far. I don't think I want to do the cargo side quests. No, 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 no. Hmm. We did it! Hello there. Hello where? Hey, if you're gonna see my gramps, go to the most northerly house. I will check with the other Gorons and go up after you. Tell them I am okay. That explosion earlier was scary. That's why I'm hiding at home. That explosion? Don't worry, that was me delivering the ice. Two ice cubes were able to do that. Yes, they were. See? Teddy's excited to watch my stellar gameplay. Who was saying hello to me? As soon as the path to village was restored, everyone went home. Boo on them. You see, there is one place left off. One very important place. Why? I want to go to my home, too. Will you please bring more of the cold stuff? I'm busy. I want to do is go home. <laughs> I'm not getting more cold stuff for you. Eddie looks hyped as hell. Hell yeah, he does. The sky is raining dangerous objects. Please be careful. Uh, crystal. You got a star fragment. Fallen from the sky. Oh, wonder where that could come from. This guy wants to go home, but I'm busy, chat. We can't help him. I am genuinely amazed that my plan worked. I was mentally preparing myself to have to go back and get the ice. Show of hands, did anybody in chat expect that to work? Did anyone here <laughs> think I was just coping? Uh... What's this now? Ah, it is good to be home. All right, then. Is this the Elder, finally? Hello, Elder. How are you? Hmm, who are you? The Elder certainly is imposing, isn't he? If we want him to help us, you better make a good impression. Gramps? Gramps? Oh, my grandchild! Are you all right? We were all so worried about you. This boy fixed the path to the village, Gramps. That is how I could make it back home. Is that so? Oh, so you are the human Kagoron spoke of. I am the elder of the village. Thank you for your help. Now you are like a Goron to us all. I have heard why you want to see me. You want the secret that has been entrusted only to Goron elders, yes? Well, on this special occasion, I will allow you to pass. No one has been this way in a while, so be careful. All right. Well, I guess we can go. Let's get the next flute part done. Okay, hang on. Okay. Plus three bombs, chat. Three bombs. Just whip them a little bit and get them out of the way. Hmm. Here's a skull. Fun, a lot of stuff now. Demon fossil. It looks like a normal fossil, but much more valuable. Alright, works for me. Shortcut for getting back. This is working okay. I- no, 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 no! Tell me it didn't take my shield again. Just run, run, I'm not dealing with those again. Heck 
those meanies. Why is everyone so mean to me today? What did I do, chat? What did I do to deserve it? Oh, my hand is getting really tired and cramped, I have to say. All right, let me just let me just stretch my fingers a little bit. Hmm. I said a bad word. What did I say? Heck, while well dying. Bomb plants. Yeah, the tanks carry you. Hang on a second. Why does it look like that wall is different? Hang on. Come on. No, I thought the wall was different because the way it looked. Okay, that's good. Okay, nice. Bridge is done. Did you miss a prediction? Um, don't think there was. Hmm. Hold up, hold up. Sorry. Ugh, probably missing a few redeems there. I was really distracted during, like, the last few train sections. I feel like the cannon did not want to cooperate. Maybe it had something to do with how there was more enemies than normal, but, like... I mean, I also kept hitting the damn train signs at the crossing. And the darn rail did not want to switch when I was tapping it. I don't know. So, we got a bunch of these guys... Let me see if we can find a thing that tells us what to do. Ah, there it is. Opening the door of friendship. Oh, whoopee. Here we go. Should you make a prediction for the, the flute section? I suppose you can. Well, it shouldn't take too long. I'm used to him now. Once upon a time, two men fell in love with a beautiful woman. One man was popular and always the center of attention. But all he cared about was the beautiful woman he had fallen in love with. Unfortunately for him, the woman only had eyes for the other man. The battle for the woman's love grew and set sparks hot enough to melt stone. Eventually, friendship shone between the men like a light uniting the pair. It was as if a door had been unlocked. Um. Okay. Can I turn these? Hmm. No, it doesn't look like it. Is there anything else I can interact with here? Can I hit them with the whip? No. Let me reread the thing. Opening the door of friendship, two men fell in love with a beautiful woman, one man was popular, always the center of attention, all he cared about was the beautiful woman he had fallen in love with. Fortunately for him, the woman only had eyes for the other man, the battle for the woman's love grew and sent sparks hot enough to melt stone. Eventually, friendship shone between the men like a, a light uniting the pair, as if a door had been unlocked. Uh, doesn't look like I can draw anything on this door. Is there anything else I can interact with? Maybe I'm supposed to, like, play a song somewhere? Hang on, what songs do I have again? Let me double check. Awakening, healing, birds, light, discovery. The words didn't imply that. Uh... All the statues are the same looking one. Um Hang on, let me let me check those again. What were their names? Light. Hang on.
No! That's not what I wanted. I was trying to get it to just work. There are no birds around. Thank you, game. I didn't know that. All right, let me try again. Damn, this thing doesn't want to work today. You can hear me blowing, but it's not going in now. Uh-oh. No! <laughs> Come on. No. There we go. Come on. Play the song of light. There are no crystal switches around. Okay, that didn't work either. Um. Can't read the sign from this angle. Once upon a time, two men fell in love with a beautiful woman. Which statue is supposed to be the woman, though? One man was popular and always the center of attention. All he cared about was the beautiful woman he had fallen in love with. Fortunately for him, the woman only had eyes for the other. Battle for the woman's... Eventually, friendship shone between the two men like a light. So I'm looking for the... T I have to deduce which two are the two men and play the song of light between them, I think. Alright, let me just start drawing lines between them all. You go up. You go... Hold up. Yeah, that's why that is. Center of attention. Is it just these two then? Hang on. <laughs> All right. Hey, I figured it out. There we go. I was close to it already. All right. That was kind of a crusty puzzle. You did it. All right, we're in here. Look at you. Excuse me, are you the guardian of this realm? Anjin told us about you. So you've arrived at last, boy, and you too, Zelda of Hyrule. My name is M... Uh... Ambrose. I get it. And I am indeed this realm's guardian. On behalf of the Fire Realm, let me extend a hearty, hearty welcome. Wow, he certainly is peppy, isn't he? You know, the Locomos are pretty unique people. And Ambrose is no exception. Ambrose? Ambrose, eh? You should look people in the eye when you're talking to them. Oh, I'm sorry. You should- you need to- you need to make the other person feel what you're saying. But I digress. In case you're wondering, yes, I know who you are. You're here to restore the spirit tracks, right? Good answer. And good posture and volume. You remind me of myself, boy. And I'm very impressed with the courage it took to make it here. Now, in order to restore the lost spirit tracks, I need your help. You know about the Locomo song. Of course. As you know, each song requires two instruments to play correctly. Now listen, I will play your part first, so try to do what I do. This is the part you gave up on as a child. All right, let's figure it out. This will be fun. When you think you have it, put your flute down. Okay. Purple, yellow, purple, yellow, blue. Oh, no. Well, we know what it is. Let's just do it. Okay, this is- I'm gonna get it instantly. Instantly, chat. Watch. Watch, watch. Here we go. You also quit this part as a child? Revenge. <laughs> it 
It's not reading it anymore. <laughs> accept it anymore uh, sometimes it just stops accepting mic inputs I swear to god mm. It won't accept them anymore now. I'm trying. I'm holding it at like every angle, but it like it won't even do it now. What happened? It was working a second ago. All right, let's try again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. Can you hear me blowing? I hope you can. <laughs> it, as soon as it goes to the yellow one, it just stops accepting the microphone. Oh my goodness. Uh... All right, I'm gonna have to just keep trying. That's all I can do. Ugh. Oh. Is the yellow one broken? Can you believe this crap, Teddy? Can you believe this crap? I can get the purple one to start, but as soon as it go I move over to the yellow, it's like, no. No, that you can't play it anymore. You might be overdoing it. Oh, stop it. Stop it. You really think, like, what the devs, like, were, when they made this feature, were like, yeah, this, this is good. People are going to love this. <laughs> I, I haven't even... I can't even get to the point where I need to skip a note. The yellow one just doesn't want to, like, go in. Which is weird, because if the purple one's working, then dragging it should make it work, right? Hmm. Okay. I don't understand. Why does the yellow one just not work anymore? I I've never had this issue in any of the previous flute sections. have to keep trying all I can do. Oh, that's kind of bad to look at when I do it like this. Oh, boy. Mm. <laughs> Chat, I need my inhaler. I actually need my inhaler. This is so bad. Uh, hang on. No, 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 not yet. I'm getting, I'm actually getting out of breath doing this crap. Oh man. Okay, okay. 
<laughs> Don't die. No, 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 chat. I'm an engineer. I can do this. I'm an engineer. No, no, chat. The microphone doesn't work like that. You can't just, like... You can't just, like, tap it or crunkle, like, a piece of paper next to it for to read a, a noise. It has to be, like, a continuous input, so you have to blow for it to work. Oh. Okay. I can see why this is the one that made people just quit. me blowing when it goes to the yellow right you can all hear me blowing as soon as i drag it to yellow it's like no no i'm sorry chad i feel like i've had a lot of freakouts over the controls today but i guess it is an emulated ds game on wii u yellow refuses to work like i'm not losing my mind it looks like that from your guys's perspective too right obviously i'm looking at my game pad trying to blow into the damn thing <laughs> All right, let's try again. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. No. <sighs> ah. What? What? Huh? I didn't even get to blow! <laughs> what happened? I didn't even do it! <laughs> Chad is freaking out, I didn't even do it right! <laughs> Did, I don't even know what happened! <laughs> Did the game just take pity on me? Is that a feature? I, I didn't even blow into the blue. I didn't even get a single blue input. What did I do? What, what is this episode? Oh, man. <laughs> All right, raw skill. You can play the duet with Ambrose, the Locomo, the Fire Realm. The Fire Realm map has started glowing. You clipped it? I need to look at that later. Genuinely, someone please... Ch did I actually get the blue input? I don't think I did. I literally... When it worked, I literally set the gamepad down on the side table. I wasn't even looking at it anymore. And then I heard the jingle that said it was done. And I'm like, what? What? <laughs> Does the game force it to, like, continue after some failed attempts? I, I have never heard anything about that. It doesn't, I promise you. Okay. <laughs> Man. That was wild. <laughs> oh, wow. The Fire Rail map has started glowing. New tracks have appeared. I don't think there's a pity failsafe. People familiar with the game are saying there isn't, so... You did it. That was the best performance yet. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Come on, let's make our way to the Fire Temple. Thank you so much, Ambrose. Well done indeed. Just one thing before you go. The mountain's rife with danger, so talk to people at the village before you go. Okay. Saving. I'm saving. Let me hydrate. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> Let me just... Oh, <laughs> I am so... Oh, man. Let me see. All right. Nothing back there. Well, we updated the crappy rail map. Let's get the hell out of here. I can't believe the crap. <laughs> I didn't even get it! I didn't even get it, but it, I did! This is so weird. Okay, those make the bridge appear. Hang on, can I get these for anything? Let me find out.
Yep, take you. Let's do this right here. Yeah, there's a bridge up there, but is it gonna give me anything? Oh boy. Let me see where these what these will give me. Oh, pick it up. We got a Rudo crown. Heck yeah. Ain't that something? Oh, that's the stamp station. I'll visit Nico and get like one freaking item. Cause I'm not gonna go get all the stamps. I can't fall down the bridges. I guess that makes sense because they're so narrow. They don't want people to like fall because of the touch screen. I am so confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. The flute just like, the flute was just like, nah. Hang on. Uh oh. Let's ignore those guys. I don't want them stealing my shield. Let's ignore the fire keys. Ignore. Yes, Teddy. Let's do it. Yes, Teddy. Let's do it. Oh, it appears everything went well. You must be quite the musician. Yes, yes, yes. I'm quite the musician. I can assure you of that. Will you go directly to the fire temple now? Of course. Well then, just remember this much. There is a gate to the fire temple protected by three locks, but some mischievous monsters stole the keys. Without getting all the keys back from the monsters, you can't open the doors. Did you write all that down? Um, kill monster for keys? Yeah, I didn't need to write that down. This is Zelda. Right? Yes. The people of the mountain village know a lot about the monsters. Go ask them for advice. Okay. My gramps always said the mountains were dangerous, even for adults. Be careful out there. Okay. Okay. Looking at the clip, it doesn't look like I even activated the blue one. That's... <laughs> that's that's weird. I think that's the last flute section in the game, right? Or is there one more after that? We should find out. Let's read the stuff here. The monsters in the mountain don't look like... Don't like a certain noise. The noise goes like this. One... Oh, no. Oh. It's gonna be one of these. What is this, like Morse code telling them to get lost? <laughs> one short noise. Um, I think I should just get a notebook out. <clears throat> uh, where did I put my notebook? Oh, here it is. Ah, it's falling. That's, if it's triggered by voice, that's gonna suck. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be... I just ripped the page out of my notebook really close to the microphone. I wasn't even thinking. <laughs> Startled, you guys. Let me get a pen. Ooh. This here. Tell me... Wait, please tell me this is the microphone, right? Or not, not the microphone. I was getting close to having to take my inhaler during that. I'm not even kidding. Like, I was just blowing and blowing. It would not work. <laughs> Hang on. One short noise. And one long noise. I think that's just the train whistle. I think I just have to toot for this. Yes, yes, write that down, write that down. All right. Uh, damn, everything's in the way. Like, gone, go run. I don't know what sound that is, but it works. Just don't forget now. Yeah, 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 that's good. Writing things down makes it easier to remember anyway. I hear that monsters on the mountain do not like big noises. I am not sure what noise, though. Maybe you should imitate animals they don't like. Okay, well, he's repeating other stuff. This is the Wii U game. This is on the Wii U, friend, yeah. All right, let's get this right here. So, 
do, do you guys still think I could probably finish the game next ep next stream? Because it looks like we just have the fire temple and the end part of the, the tower left. You got the demon fossil. Are you going to the mountain? The monsters there are strangely powerful. Once you retrieve three keys, you can return here as fast as you can. Okay. Okay, it's, there's a lot more than that. Okay. Then I won't plan for that, then. For now, let me check the other, other Gorons. There's no one in that one, right? few more flute sections. Okay. Are you going to the mountain? The monsters there are strangely powerful. Once you retrieve three keys, return here as fast as you can. Okay. I talked to that one already. What about you? Actually, I tried to get rid of the monsters on the mountain myself, but they're all big cowards. They only, uh, they are only fast when they run away. Do not do anything fancy like try to get behind them, hit them straight on. Okay. Hit them straight on, chat. Write that down, too. Not yet. Not yet, buddy. All right, that covers everybody there, I think. Hmm. I think we got what we need. So the fire temple's up the mountain. Shall we go? Let's. Okay, but let's be careful. Hit the monsters, and that'll be fine. Alright. This episode's been quite wild. So, find three monsters. Somewhere all around there. Oh, this could take a while. I don't really have a chance to backtrack right now from here either. Oopsie. Hang on, I'm trying to move stuff. Oops. Didn't mean to hit that. Okay, no problem. Let's speed up the train. Move faster a little bit. <laughs> Hang on a second. Holy moly. Oh, wow. Oh, there's one. Okay, I see them. This seems like it's gonna be a big pain in the ass to do, yeah. I need to hit them straight on. Can't come from behind against them, I see. So maybe that won't work. That's the case. Let's plan to bump into this one with where he's going. Hopefully, anyway. Because the damn thing is working now. This thing on the, the track thing feels kind of finicky sometimes, I swear. Anyways, let's just go this way, actually. Ah, oh, damn it. Wait, is he coming this way? Never mind, he's turning. The way he's going is a bit of a pain in the ass. Let's do this. This game... Oh... Oops. I glanced over at chat and that happened. This game is very annoying, but very fun. I mean, yeah, it has some crust to it that certainly uh, feels a bit outdated, but it's still nice. Oh no, is it not turning? That's not the route I wanted to take, you jerk. Well, I didn't change the tracks. All right, I'm just gonna keep going this way then, whatever. I hope y'all are having a good time watching this, because I feel like I th this episode has made me want to pull my hair out a few different times. <laughs> Excellent. I kind of want to keep going now that we're out of the, the, the icy parts. <laughs> Am I losing my mind? Are, are, is some, was some of this stuff earlier really easy, and I'm just like... Oh.
Okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. There's one. Whew. Okay, pop that there. He's officially dead. Now let's just ignore those guys. Hang on. I think this will work. He's coming and going. He's turning. I feel like it's universal that most people generally don't like the flute sections, but what about, like, the train escort and the ice? I got through that on, on a miracle. Okay. Keep going. I need the camera a certain way. Okay. There we go. Took it. No one likes the escort missions? Okay, good. Okay, now we gotta go meet the other guy. I can't see where I am. Yeah, let's stun you. He's gonna bother me still. Okay. Looks like he's gonna go down that way, which means we'll probably have to catch him like this. Yeah, I think we can do this now. We're going super speedy. Oh, boy. I say this as someone who, as a kid, did, like, every, every like, side mission in Phantom Hourglass. It's not worth it. It never is never worth it. This is a bad spot for this to happen. Okay, got him. We're gonna meet this guy in a second. We can do this. Oh, hang on. I wish I could turn the camera faster, but the camera only turns with touchscreen inputs. So it's a little annoying. Especially when it gives you more enemies when there's specific enemies or characters being escorted. can't see him. Where's the one with the key? Oh, did he get away? Thanks a lot. Dude, those things are the worst. When the can when the freaking train goes up a slope, it like messes with the camera and makes it harder to turn too. Okay, he's gonna turn around again. We can't do that, so we're gonna have to do this. For now. Oh, dude. They better despawn after this segment. Okay, now let's do this. I'm trying my best to focus here, and I don't know how I'm winning. To be fair, my miracle play with the, um... My miracle play with the bombs to refresh the ice was amazing. Wait, is he still going that way? The one with the key? He is. Oh, that jerk. There we go. Work. Oh, no. I'm gonna have to go all the way ar around because of how his path in works. Oh, this sucks. Okay. You'll have to catch him like this. <laughs> if it wasn't for that random success, we'd still be blowing in the mic right now. I know, right? What the hell even was that? <laughs> I feel like I've been, like, moaning and groaning and bitching this whole episode, which is funny with my anime in the corner, but, um... Oh, hang on. Let me get that bunny. Let me get that bunny. Gotcha. You got a mountain rabbit? Go show the guy at Rabbitland Rescue. One day I'll return there when the path isn't inconvenient as hell. I 
I hit the goddamn sign again. The camera needs to stop auto-turning when I'm going down the slope. Wait, what? Where'd he go? Oh, I got behind him again? He moved like that? Oh, no. Hang on. No, 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 no. Stop that. Stop that. Oh, come on. Reversing this damn train is the worst thing ever. Camera won't even go high enough. Dude. I'm getting so sick of these things. All right, I guess I'm just going to go forward. I can't back up anymore. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> this is the Spirit Tracks experience. Let's move those away. Where's he at? I'm tapping directly in the center and it keeps like going around him. I can't stress how bad it is when you're going up a slope because the camera just auto turns to face the train instead of letting you hit the damn enemy. Dude, now he's over there and I can't even keep track of them because these guys won't go away. Maybe like this I'll reach him. I can't get to the blue guy. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, go away. No, oh, don't, don't go up the slope. Oh, oh, man. They're stunned for like a fraction of a second. Okay. Now he's going all the way down there again. Fantastic. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. Chat, with the power of hot cocoa in ten years is on my lap. We can do this. We can do this. Okay, he's gonna come around. Wait, he's turning like that, so we gotta catch him here. If I can actually reach him this time. Okay, it looks like the other two have pissed off for a little bit. I think. Ah. This episode is just like back-to-back -back sections of like making people want to squ quit the game, which according to the chat, people did. Oh, uh, I don't know how I even got through the flute. Turn. Why is it always on a slope? Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. He's coming this way, right? Holy crap, finally, finally. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's get there. We can do it. We can do it. Yes, we can. All right. Now let's just get all the way over there. I've passed these same boulders so many times, blowing them up each time. They're still gonna mess with me, huh? Here they come. Camera. Just take him out, just take him out, just take him out. They're going that way. They're going that way. Hey, <laughs> they're going that way. Did we do it? Did we make it, chat? Please tell me we made it. We can do it. We're almost there. gonna go okay he's not coming this way I think we did it we're finally done with them oh so many people here today to see me 
confuse and rage at train. <laughs> oh boy. Let's pop in. We're so close. Come on. Wish this thing could move a little faster. But I've been at top speed the whole time. No more snowmen hitting me. No more. Fire temple. We made it. We made it. Well, now that I've reached the temple, I kind of want to just do it. <laughs> to be honest, yeah. It seems the temple sits here at the very summit of the mountain. Well, there's no time to waste. Let's restore the spirit tracks and return to Anjin. All right. Before that, though, I really got to pee. Because, like, I want to do the temple because I don't want to end it on having to do back-to-back -back ice uh, ice transporting, broken glitchy flute section, and then uh, having to do whatever the hell that, that just was to get in the temple. I want to end it on an actual temple. Give the fans what they want. Okay, I have just returned, and I got some hot cocoa, and we're going to go ahead and do the fire temple now. Like I was just saying, I want to end this on beating a temple because after doing that elephant part, I feel like that would be a sour note to stop. Apparently that part's a little bit infamous as people were saying. And let me do this. Oop. The fancy thing back into the game. All right, let's get cozy and do it. I don't think I really want to do side quest stuff now. Ooh, hang on a second. This this theme is actually different. Okay, break that with you. The first three dungeon themes were exactly the same and now we got a new one. Missed him. Okay, we got it. So we've got multiple locked doors. Let's see if we can do it. Um, This is an elevated thing right here. I feel like I need to adjust my own volume slider. Give me a second here. All right, friends, welcome back. That's right. I made some cocoa. I had a little bit of a breather, which I kind of needed. We have a lot of people here, which is still weird to me. I feel like when I go through a bunch of like weird sections like that, I'm like, oh yeah, it's time. this is where we bleed viewers. And then no, we have more people than normal. Watching me freak out over the train. All right, no problem. Let's do it. Enemies are here. Stealthos, finally. Can I bomb them? Nope, they're gonna do that. Maybe I gotta whip them. Okay, I see. I do just whip them. It's better than waiting for a bomb to go off. I don't think there really are more train games to play in the future. <laughs> we'll have to see. Okay, what do we have here? The pitfalls here mirror those on the other side, so make note of them. Oh. Okay. Mirror those on the other side, huh? Okay. There's a pit there. I'll just draw a circle. Probably the easiest way to do it. Okay, a circle to my right. Circle to the south. That's a good enough circle. Don't worry about it. Circle there. Okay, that's no big deal. We go up here. We can do this. Change to... Oops, wrong thing. Remember, chat, I'm an engineer. I'm, I'm certified to operate the train. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I thought I couldn't reach it for a second. A little pedestal shows up there. This is... <sighs> I didn't mean to move that close to it. Oops. Okay. Train simulator? Mm, I don't know about that. I don't think I need to play a game like that. What's this dilapidated old thing? Looks like some kind of vehicle. We got train tracks. Who saw that coming? 
Haven't seen these in a handheld Zelda since, like, the Oracle games, right? Except, you all, you know, the, the train tracks and the over... You know, that's different, you know what I mean? That's right, I'm an engineer. Does anybody here in chat doubt my qualifications? Do you? I'll have you know that Princess Zelda herself gave me my certificate. Let's head over here. Weren't... Yeah, I guess they were in Minish Cap, weren't they? Okay, we got the key, so let's go down. Looks like this is all we can do. And the princess died? Well, that's not my fault. That's not my fault. Maybe if Hyrule Castle had some competent guards in some one of the timelines, maybe this wouldn't happen. And what does this do? And stand on it. Either way. Surely we can unlock these in any order, so let's have a look. Okay, so I need to... Now, what's this thing for? Hmm. I need to hit both switches, which means I need both keys for this to work. Oh, I can pick it up. I thought I tried tapping it. I guess I throw this on top of that. Alright, works for me. Hold up. Okay, I know what to do. I know what to do. Video games are fun, chat. It has been a very comfy stream. I mentioned at the start that uh, I was kind of sick last night again. And <laughs> this was probably the worst thing to play, all things considered. But uh, I guess uh, dealing with all that stuff took my mind off things. Still have no idea what the hell happened with um, the flute section, but hey. Okay. Go down. Do do. There we go. Oh, nice. Free potion. I actually had space for it, so hold up. Gotta go under. Nice to give me a whole ass potion for that. Whew. Thank you, Dra uh, Dramie in there for the sub. I appreciate it. Everybody's been so nice giving subs lately. Hmm. Just blame Nintendo Innovation. Always. Always. Oh? No, 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 no. That's a little awkward to hit here, isn't it? Try the whip. Okay. I get it. I get it. A wood heart. Okay, now I'm just gonna ride the whole thing again. No, it needs to be changed. Alright, now let's go this way. No, wait, what? Oh, I thought I had it. I gotta hit them both on the way there. Do they reset as soon as I get off the damn thing? Either way, the whip is definitely the best thing to use for this. Okay, no problem. No problem. Get whipped, sucker. There you go. And this should be the other small key. Nothing we can do except ride the trail all the way thing. They do switch back automatically. Let me have a sip of my cocoa, because cocoa is comfy. Ah, delicious. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I can go up this way. Right, the shortcut. Oops. I made a mistake, chat. Should I restart the playthrough after that? Hmm. Alright, boomerang it is.
What's even the point of playing video games anymore if we didn't play them perfectly, chat? Come on. The title said 100% speedrun. I wouldn't want to lie to the viewers. Oh. Turtle! Maybe I gotta whip him. Let's try that. <clears throat> Pardon me. Damn it, he already went. Oh. Oh, he's gotta hit those. Damn it. Just gotta get him to bump into this. Damn, I got too close to him. Oh, he does not want to bump into these guys. You are making this very frustrating, Mr. Turtle. Could you do me a huge favor and just, like, come on? Come here, here we go. Okay, good. Finally hit him with the sword already. Oh, he bumped into it on his own. Okay, much better now. Two sword hits. Got him! Look at that! Oh, boy. Yeah, when you get shocked, it disorients you by, like, making the map all pixely above you. Oh, okay, that's for a chest. So this must be the dungeon item. The bow and arrow. Pretty basic. I knew it was gonna be here, though. Oh, there's only one more item slot? Okay, that must be the last unique item that's in this game. Oh, I'm just having... I'm just remembering, yes, there is definitely more than just the spirit tower after this game. Okay. Definitely ain't finishing this next stream for sure, yeah. Two more streams at least. Bow and arrow. Only a single arrow, yes. Ah, this thing is back. Clever way of teaching you how it works. Tapping it. Dark Pearl Loop. Maybe I'll go to the very edge of the map in the south and get this all done again. Kind of forgot I could pick them up, to be honest. Get beamed. Okay. Let's do this. We did it. Master puzzle solver bear strikes again. I felt like the last temple was kind of like the first real temple, if that makes sense. Well, the Spirit Temple's been get got better after the Ocean Temple as well. It felt like the first two were really, like, basic and short. Remember, the only way to open this door is with the key. Um. Okay, hang on, chat. I, bet, bet, I gotta write that down. I gotta write that down. Write that down. Door. Only. Opens with key. Don't want to forget that. Don't want to forget that. Important. Oh, 
There we go. Now we won't forget. Now we won't... We won't accidentally forget that this door, this locked door, opens only with a key. There we go. Let's check downstairs. Uh-oh. That's right. You're getting beamed. Oh, I'm getting steamed. Oh, no, you don't. Haha. <laughs> Hang on, I can grab those skulls. Next session, I'll be like, what does that note mean? Hey, 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 hey. Don't be talking about me like that. I am Super Mr. Streamer Man. How dare you? I have an engineer certificate. Nothing else over there. Okay, this goes over here. I've hit that one already. Wait, what? I don't remember doing that. That's a grapple hook. What does the switch do? Does it stop this fire? Yes, it does. Okay. Do that. We did it. Teddy's win again. Okay, those are falling. We did it. Do you think streamer doesn't know how to play video games? Nonsense. That's the streamer life. Is you play a video game for like four hours, and if you make a mistake for five seconds, people will remind you about it till the end of time. That's the streamer life. Oh yeah. Or a funny glitch will happen that will completely bail you out of the flute section. <laughs> that was so silly. That was really silly. I genuinely want to know what happened there. If like, if some spirit tracks like speedrunner expert knows what happened, just tell me in the comments. Also because it gives me engagement. Heck yeah. Perfect. Excellent. No, if I really wanted debate engagement, I would just call every game I play bad and make people argue in the comments over it. I know that there's some streamers that actually do that, by the way, and it's insufferable. Here we go. I can't stand people who get mad about everything and then brag on Twitter that they rage bait all the time. It's like, come on. Like, whoopee, you're insufferable to watch. You sure showed me. You're showing everybody. That's a tangent I'm just going on now. Dark Pearl Loop. Okay, let's do this. I need to bring something over here. But where is it? Move this here. All engagement is good en engagement. Oh, I see what to do. Damn it! It bounced off the walls there. Nice! We did it. Daddy's win. That, that's more true than ever, by the way, like the engagement thing. Especially since on like social media, you can get like a payout if your posts get like enough engagement now. So all everyone anyone does is just post like rage bait articles and the algorithm just pushes it in front of everybody and I hate it. I just want to check social media for cute art and stuff and instead I gotta instead I get to see like Twitter gimmick accounts just post clips of people getting like attacked in public or car accidents and it's like no. Hang on, I think these guys gotta bump into each other. Oh boy. Hang on, I'm gonna need to use the potion. Play it safe. I don't want to hear the- I just don't want to hear the beep theme. Okay. Or do I gotta use- I probably gotta use the bow on them. Oh. Oh, that was surprisingly more simple than I was expecting. Not gonna lie. You want to have comfy time, not daily dose of dread? Yeah, you're telling me. 
I I was like telling like um my friend yesterday. I actually like I think I muted like five different accounts that post like fights in public and it's like I do not want to see this. Like stop showing me this. Like how and it's all from like checkmark accounts, so they're paying to basically be in the algorithm there, so that's just how it works. Aim for the eye above the third. Okay. Aim for the eye above the fourth. Aim for the eye above the first. Above the second. Is this supposed to be the order? Am I reading them left to right? Aim for the eye above the second. Okay. One. Assuming it goes left to right. Two. Three. Above the third. Four. I think I got it. Assuming it is left to right. Okay. Basement two. Let's do it. Perfect. I see an eyeball there. Let me guess. As soon as I walk off this, it's going to vanish, right? Yep. Knew it. Which means I got to bring one of those little... I yeah, right there. Do this. Easy. And now we got one of these again. Hmm. This one, yeah. Oh. No! I accidentally held the stylus there for a second too long. Come on, Link. Okay, that's a shortcut back if I need it. Oh, right, what am I doing? I can't... Can't hit those things with my sword, silly. That switch is like that. What's the purpose of this room? Oh, I, I see what I... Th I think I see what I need to do. Or do I? Hmm. Let me let me check something here. It only goes this one only goes diagonal. Okay. Problem is that won't go there. I am confused now. Let me see here. Well, now that's stuck up there. I think I may have messed it up. Hmm. If it goes diagonal, it's going to just not hit them. Can I bring this one up? I must be able to, I'm assuming. No. Alright. Okay, good. I can bring it up. I can bring it up. So if that's the case, we'll put that there. Hang on. I think I get it. I think I get it. Okay, it's not going to go through that fast enough to do it. Um... Hit the switch again. Hang on, hang on. Big Brain Streamer can do this. Don't tell me. Let me just sip some cocoa and give myself a Jimmy Neutron Brain, uh, brain Blast. Hang on, you know what I should do, chat? 
I think I know what we need. I've got hot cocoa, but you know what I need? I need a little friend. I need a little friend to hug. Look how excited Teddy is. That's right, the bear the bear makes you forget all about mistakes made in the stream. All of them. Excellent. Okay, okay. Let me hit this. Teddy is, is a good friend. Look how excited he is to see a Nintendo DS game in 2024. What mistakes? Exactly. Exactly. Let me see. Hmm. Spin to win. This one's definitely going to be a longer episode of this, but... That's fine. Tomorrow, I might do the uh, the only long stream of the week, though. Um, I wanted to finish Pikmin, but I also wanted to play the Moomin game that came out, because it turns out it has a streamer mode that can mute copyright. I'm confused about how the hell I... Can't hit this one again. Okay, hang on. I can use the arrow weather's delay. No! It doesn't go up fast enough! Okay. Ah. The hell else am I missing here, then? Um, okay. Don't think I was supposed to do that. Just a little scared it's gonna break things. Oh, come on! <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to do that, right? top of each other. There's not enough time for it to, like, hit that. Hmm. Oh, the answer's gotta be staring me in the face. Hey, hang on. Let me actually sip my cocoa this time. Come on, Teddy. We can big brain this together. Come on, Teddy. Did you know that, like, half the YouTube comments call Teddy dumb? Are you gonna let that stand, Teddy? I'm just joking. Most of the YouTube comments are just fine. YouTube comments is like anything. It's a human issue. 99% of y'all are little beans. For sure. It's gotta be staring me in the damn face, and I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do, because it doesn't seem like it can raise fast enough to hit that. There's no north one. Oh, let Teddy play. He knows the answer. He, he looks like he wants to play, but he can't. Can I, like, pick this up or something? Maybe that'll work. Are you serious? Oh, all right, let me just reach into the lava and pull up my molten rock. <laughs> Does that mean these are for hitting the switch from there? Teddy's paws are too sticky from honey. Teddy cannot game properly. Confirmed. Well, that didn't work the way I wanted. You know what? Heck this, I'll hit it myself. I don't need you. Okay, I see. Oh, I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay. 
There we go. Genius Teddy strikes again. I didn't think I could pick up the blue rock again, like, at all. Wait a second! Wait a second! Chat. Chat, do you know what this is? You know what that is? Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. Oh my god, it's for this! Holy crap. I'm so glad I wrote that down. Didn't mean to keep holding that there. Woo! Hang on, does that go up the stairs? That is where I want to go, right? I think so. Just like the note said. I'm sure I'm glad I checked that stone tablet next to the locked door. No, but really, why the hell is that there? I see a stamp. Let me see. Oh, hitting those things is gonna suck, isn't it? Well, I know the order. Okay, it's gonna go, go in a loop. Ends the loop. We did it. I'll never guess how to get the stamp. Is it one of those super obscure ones? You can tell me. That one's fine because I don't really want to get it anyway. Okay, we go down this way. Oh, what do we have here? Um, okay. Circle that. Circle that. This one, I see the boss key in the boss door. This dungeon doesn't feel that long. Er, perfect. You have to aim for the lower left corner of the room and there's a hidden switch there. Okay. Hold up, I want to get it now. Just for the heck of it. For the beans and the memes. <sighs> You'd never know that was there unless someone told you. Well, I got it. Oof, I thought it was falling to my death. That's a really mean one. That's unlike Zelda dungeon design, to be honest. Well. Point is, we got it now. So now that we've done that, can I hit this? No, I cannot. Well, I don't see anything over here. Can't boomerang bombs, but I guess I need to get the bomb to that, don't I? Or, you know, I could just use my trusty bomb bag. <laughs> oh, I gotta wait for it to rise, don't I? Yeah, I do. Okay, hit the switch. Oh, wait, no. I gotta hit the switches that are actually there. I see, I see. I see. Carry the boss key by cart. Okay, then. Oh, I get ya, I get ya. Nice of the microphone to work today. Is 
So if this is how it is, hold up a second, hold up. What, what if I take the grappling hook over here? Sorry, the whip. It's just a chest. You got a dark pearl loop. Okay. Doesn't feel like I've been in this dungeon this long, but it's a it's a fun one. It's it's going by decently fast. Let me see. That was easy. First try, everybody. Do you see that, Teddy? Ooh, ouch. Fingers still a little cramped from my left hand holding up the damn gamepad the whole time. I'm good. Ooh, I'm glad people have been enjoying this one so much. Again, I said it before, but I was a little worried going back to both... Both going back to Zelda games out of nowhere and uh, also doing the PNG tuber, but everyone just seems to like it. So I'm just going to keep using it. Where impossible, that is. Step into the blue light. All right, nice. We're at the boss. Okay. Let me see. It's chill. Yes, it is nice and comfy. You're gonna need the bow, I guess. Hi. Do you want to be friends? Do you want to be friends with my bear? I do not think they want to be friends with the bear. Egg Golem would like to fight. Okay. Two screen effect looks a bit weird here, but it's fine. Okay, I gotta aim for the glowy spot. He's bleeding! Okay, it's fine. Damn it! Oh, that sucks. Okay. Just gonna get this over here. Damn it. This is fine. I know what I gotta do. Need that boulder. At least hearts can fall here. Okay. I gotta get closer. The perspective's a little weird here. No! Damn. Okay. Damn, missed that one. Easy. Easy. Nice of the tracks to switch automatically. We have so many arrows. Trying to focus. This is pretty cool for DS, for sure. Does he have a goblin tooth? Yeah, I can't seem to hit him with that. I'm supposed to hit his eye, but it doesn't look like I'm high enough to do that. There we go. Okay, I just hit his head. Easy. 
Gotta refresh on arrows, though, for sure. There was a similar, like, super tall boss in Phantom Hourglass. You had to, like, use a hammer to, like, um, break all the pieces of him as you, like, jumped around, I think. I gotta get the, uh, platform back to get on that. Okay, knock him down a bit. This makes him summon the boulder. Oop! Oh, audio still good for you guys, by the way? I don't really have enough arrows for this. Come on, drop a few more, please. That is such a stock sound effect, though, for the stuff falling. Alright, here we go. No! Oh, thank god. Okay. Just barely made that. Okay, let him go. Let him cook. He's uh, slowly turning along with me, so it's kind of awkward. <laughs> okay. Let's get to his back. Damn it, I missed. Gotta make my arrows last. I only held a total of 20. That just barely made it. Easy. And he's dead. Only had the two cycle in there. Easy. Teddy's win! Look at that. And now I got the Red Force gem. And we got that funky fire symbol there, too. Look at that. Okay, definitely two streams left of this at least, it seems. is cramped. Definitely not going to do Tower of Spirits right now. Definitely not doing that. <laughs> oh, we opened the path at least. Is that the final section? Oh yeah, for sure. Next time I come here, it's going to take a little bit. Someone said this looks like Minecraft. <laughs> Two entire dungeons done today. The real temple was delivering the ice, though, but I had some cheese for that. You've done it. Way to go, Link. You actually beat that terrifying giant of a monster. Amazing. With it defeated, all the spirit tracks should be restored. Let's head back to the Tower of Spirits. The fire rail map started glowing. Opened a tiny little pathway there. The tracks of the Tower of Spirits have been restored. You got a heart container! Ain't that nice. I feel like they don't really... They, like, they try to make me backtrack around, but it doesn't really feel like I, um... I never really feel like I'm in a spot where I want to go all the way back to, like, the forest area just to, like, drop off bunnies or something. It feels like it'd be so out of the way to do that. 
Plus, they make the spirit temple so close by as soon as you, like, finish a temple anyway, so you might as well do that. Hang on, though. We just finished a temple, so I think we should just save here. Save complete. Do it again. Because why the heck not? This is where we're going to go ahead and end this, because, yeah, I bet I'm over the four-hour mark, it looks like. Ugh. And I said I'd only do one game today to do this. I know about the warps. The issue is they won't show up. All the ones I find are the other ones, but I'm checking them. Anyways. I know I'm not doing the prize postcard. That seems like a waste of time. I don't want to do those. Anyways, let me move this over here. Let me move this over here. Today was a... Oops. Accidentally just opened up my whole, like, states there for the, the PNG tuber. <laughs> Oopsie. All right, it's, it's fine, it's fine. Anyways, hope you guys all had a fun time watching today. I've been enjoying this a lot too. Spirit Tracks has been a cozy little game to play. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Hope you all enjoyed. Have a good night, and bye-bye.